Hello, everyone, and welcome to another video of the Sports Factory podcast. Today, we're going to do some WWE stuff. We were some WWE fans, you know what I'm saying, back in the day. WWE still skyrocketing in views and ratings, but we obviously have more limited knowledge of current WWE topics because we don't watch that. We are in our mid-20s. You know, if you are in your mid-20s as well, that's fine if you watch it. Don't get offended. <laughs> but uh, we used to watch it when we were younger, 10 years ago or so. And we know some current wrestlers, some we know. So we're going to do a tier ranking list, basically to see who do we believe is, you know, where wrestlers are they at the top? Are they mid? Are they forgettable? We will see. I did a video like this last year when I was just starting off, you know what I'm saying? When I was back on my grind. I did a video like this last year. So it's time to do it again, but with better presentation. One year <laughs> so, update. Okay. One year update. So how, many, let's see. How, many, how many are there? Let's see. How many did you put on there? I put, so let me put Is this it over 30? There should, it should be. There was one list with like 100 people. I was like, I know I oh, don't have. Do that one? You don't have the patience? Oh, no, because oh, no, I don't have the patience, and I don't even know, like, I wouldn't even know to... Nah, it, w- it wouldn't be for me. Uh, yeah, it should be this one. Oh, we, let's see. Make sure it's this one actually. Now you get to remember Carlito, John. You gotta you gotta represent Carlito. Hilarious. Since I f- I failed him last year a year ago. Yeah, you ain't doing justice. After that, shit said good cancer at first. I was like, what? That been oh, tough. I was <laughs> like, what? Okay. So everyone, you see my screen. We are gonna get into this tier ranking. And we're going to get on some nostalgia lane as well. As you see here, there's all-time great. These are people that are influential. They were great on the mic, and mm-hmm. they were great and in, in the ring. Those are very important, you know what I'm saying? Very influential people. You have a good career. Maybe you weren't an all-time great, but you had a very solid career. Maybe 10 years, you're out here doing your thing. Maybe a couple main event pushes. Average career, you know, it's like, hey, you for maybe five years. You know, it's like, yeah, you did pretty good. Maybe one intercontinental title or something, you know, did a little um, forgettable. We don't really remember you or we don't really care about you. You really didn't do too much in your career or you're terrible. Your gimmick, most likely this is due to your gimmick. Your gimmick was awful. You weren't good on the mic. You get out of here. You're probably a jobber. We're going to start with the man who might be the best actor, arguably the best actor. That's a WWE former superstar in Batista. Now that's up to debate. Who's the best actor? John Cena? The no, Rock? Batista? That's him. That's him. It's probably, it should be the Batista. Yeah, it's Batista. That's him. Um, where y'all put where y'all put Batista on this? Uh it's it's it's, all, it's between the top two. I would say all time or all time great or good career. I put good career. I want to put all time because his his, <laughs> his intro is like like I don't know, I'll put I'll put all time. You put all time. Is that oh wow? Who's not next to him? Oh, okay. oh it's, it's, it's you know you got it you got it. Okay, you watch you watched your match. It's um, because it's small. Oh, I can make it full screen. My fault. There you go. Much better. But see, okay, so, so I'm looking at um, I'm thinking Batista, right? Like, Batista in 05, 06 was like the, he was everything, boy. But I don't know, like as the years went down, he, he shaved his head too. He didn't seem to when Batista with full hair hit harder than Batista with shaved head, definitely. But he had a really, he, he did. But he had a good heel run at the end of his at the end of his WWE tenure. All time great to me, dog. I'm putting him. Right. I, I put. I think he's a good career. I think. I think it's a good career. I think he he didn't last long enough for me to be like. He didn't last long enough. He yeah. quit. And it... also, he don't have nothing to like. That I just want to push him up. Besides acting, I, I don't know. He doesn't have that extra oomph that make me say the okay. intro. That intro, not an intro <laughs> in for you. His intro is nice, but I mean, I like the Undertaker intro. I, I just think there's What's other intros with? too. His intro, or are you saying his intro is the best? No, actually, I don't okay. see Kane on here. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What you see? You don't see no Kane? I think Kane, I think Kane's on there. Yeah, Kane is on there. He's just at a political office, Kane. <laughs> it's political, uh, Kane. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, yeah, I see him now. Yeah, Stone Cold. Right. Okay. So, yeah, his intro, it doesn't push him to all time great. I'm sorry. I, in fact, I like the Boogeyman intro, too. I'm the Boogeyman, <laughs> and I'm coming to get you. Yeah, that's my sisters dumb- used to make me do that dance, so. That's, yeah, that's actually wild. That's wild. <laughs> that's wild. All right, who's that? Yeah. Becky Lynch. Yeah, John, you may not know too much about Becky Lynch, but obviously, me and Maurice, we watched the um, main event of a WrestleMania where Becky Lynch was in it, and I think she won. It was like a she triple went. threat or some shit. Yeah, it, was, it was with Ronda Rousey, Becky Lynch, and Charlotte Flair. So it was a triple threat. Okay. For uh, like, I think I might put good as well. I was gonna say good or average to me, but I think, I it's, think it's I think it's like hurt because I feel like in the beginning she wasn't good if I was told, and then she got a super mega push. 
and that pushed. So that's, that pushed it to her good career. I think she had a good career. I think. Her, I and think then, she, and then she, then no, I think she, no, she's not pregnant anymore. Like she just had. No, nah, she's not pregnant no more. But she, she, she had. I think she has like a beef with Trish Stratus or something. What? I don't know. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know. If Trish Stratus on here, but um, Trish Stratus definitely be all time great. Maybe she's on here. Continue Booker with Booker T. Can you dig it? Suck up. <laughs> Wash he not. He not. Now look. I'm not obviously. He not average. And I don't. Think he, he not average. Time. He good. He like he the perfect. He the perfect good career to me. I don't know. Yes. Yeah, he not forgettable. Obviously not. Terrible. Definitely not forgettable. <laughs> He's the perfect good career. Like he the poster boy for a great for a good career. Yeah, I put him in front of Batista. Well, never mind. No, no. Oh, okay. I keep him oh, behind Batista. Are we oh, doing it like that? Or? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, hey, let's do it like that. Just, just in case. It no, just in case now. we rack up a lot of good careers. Uh-huh. Let's do let's do some let's do some tears. Let's, well, let's, that's because I to do that afterwards. Then, now, I mean, it's harder so. if you have all these people already. I mean, I might. I mean, you can adjust it at the end. But you, um, I don't know if he. I don't know. No, if he no, 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 no. I'll take it back. He's yeah. He's he in between. Yeah, he. he I mean, he was kind of. I don't know. It's, it's different because like I when I start watching wrestling, you know, but at the time he was definitely more impactful. So no, they had a I backstage saw. fight. They had a backstage fight, like a real fight, What's and Booker what? and Booker T won. That's hilarious. Booker T oh, beat up with him and Steven uh, Stone Cold. No, what? Booker T and Batista. I'm talking about a real oh. life fight. I ain't talking about no fake. I'm talking about some real oh, life. Fight. No like wrestling, that. like actually. no wrestling. Like they upset and <laughs> Booker they T. Why they and Booker T won. I don't know why they fought. Maybe it was some politics. Maybe it was some they didn't agree with. But Booker T won. He said. He said. He Interesting. Said uh, All so. hail King Booker. Oh, um, <laughs> yeah, he had a good gimmick too. The King Booker shit was like the King fire. Booker is the dumbest, most was hilarious thing. <laughs> man, he kissed my feet. I love you. That's hilarious. He a funny guy, okay. and I always remember the time when he uh he said the n word talking about to Hulk Hogan. Yeah. That's, yeah. Always, <laughs> that's always all time great, all time great moment too. And he was so pissed. Um, Brock Lesnar. He got now, Brock. If, if he if he not good career, then it gotta be. Nah, just, yeah, he probably gotta be, yeah. I don't. Know. Yeah, he got. Right, who it depends who you would like more, Batista or Brock? I no, think all time like, great. I think all time great at this point. I think if you just did his first run. Then maybe good career, but then he'd been in the in here for ten years. He got like yeah. he had he had the he'll, title for like five hundred days, back, and he just still. And he got crazy. that cowboy game. He got a cowboy gimmick now. It's hilarious to see. He got. Oh well, yeah, he heel now. No, he not heel. He uh. No, not he not heel face, now. He, right? No, he oh, heel. He, now. Heel? Oh. he he beefed with Cody Rhodes. Oh, I thought he was a face. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm put your all time great. You got, he had like the, the bottom of all time great though. He's not. Yeah, he at the bottom of it. Yeah, definitely at the yeah, bottom. It's a debatable all time great. Oh, there go your boy. <laughs> I this, spit in the this, face this, of this stupid. is your time, your, your chance. I put him at average, but yeah, okay. I, I put him at that. average. I put Wait, him at what average. Did, what did I put him at then? I think you put him because I I adjusted the like because you put him at like. I think I put I think him I put high. Him, I know I put him high. You put him pretty and then high. You yeah. adjusted it down, and I was like, okay, it don't matter. I think that's what some shit happened. I'm, I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say he forgettable. <laughs> yeah, but I'm definitely I'm definitely like he definitely not like high in the average. He like mid average to me. Like yeah. he has that gimmick. He has a good gimmick with the spitting thing, but after that, well, that's, like, I mean, that's, that's what makes you remember him. That's what I'm saying. I know, but there's like, no other like. Every, if every, I feel like if he didn't have that, then he would be forgettable. Yeah, he I know. Like, he had the spitting, but then like you don't know his finisher, and you don't know. So like, saying that, that's the reason why. You know, that's what. No, that's why. High. That's yeah, why you can't be too high. We'll, we'll take average. I mean, I, say average. I won't fight for good career. If there was good, I'll probably put him with good. I don't know. I think yeah, I mean, he, he averaged to forgettable in between there. Yeah, he like yeah, right, he, yeah, fair. yeah. Because is that is that Charlotte? <laughs> that's Charlotte Flair. I'm gonna put her at good as well. I'll put her at good. She she not she not hitting like her daddy do. Uh, yeah, that's I don't really it. know much about the women's career, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm putting her at good. I'm not sure about I'm that putting, one. But Chris Jericho, we gonna put Chris Jericho. We ain't gotta even think twice, three times, four times, five times. Nice. I put you right up here at all time great Break ahead of the Pro. walls down. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he got like amazing intro, great character. He a heel. Remember my man when he had the suit. Oh, that's when they really hate him. When he had the suit, I don't remember that one. You don't remember when he had the suit and Big mm. Show was with him. Jarrah Show. That's such a stupid thing. I or, don't remember that at all. Yeah, you, you gotta go back to like 2009. I don't remember <laughs> that at all. I think I'm, there was a. Go ahead. I'm not gonna lie. I don't think he's all time great. I would have said good career well, as well. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, to you. I'm, I'm going good career on that one. I no, guess it'll kind of be like at the end if we reconvene, but. It's like the all time greats. I got like a list in my head already of who's the all time great. I just don't feel like he belonged up there with them. Honestly, I don't even think Brock Lesnar, but I'll I'll concede I know, I know to that. Brock I think Brock Lesnar got to okay. no, I'll concede I, to I that. Think, I, th- I think I mean if you put in Brock, I mean you put both. Look, look, I think Chris is more impactful than Brock, so I would have to drop because if really? Chris goes to good, yeah, because Chris, 
Now, Brock took 10 years off, came in. He didn't want to talk, so yeah, Paul Heyman talked for him. That little duo is cool. But Chris Jericho's ability to be a face, to be a heel, to have great in-ring battles, rivalries with HBK and all that. I mean, look, I, if I, I don't know. That's one of the things that people, I don't, you know. I don't know what because now now we now we're in a conundrum. Does <laughs> okay, so. this so. make sense? I forgot uh, his show with HBK. His show with HBK is like most iconic shit. That's probably HBK, HBK's best rival along with Triple H is Chris Jericho. Them shits are I mean, he punched his wife. He is punched Shawn Michaels' wife. His, his best friend, <laughs> Undertaker. <laughs> nah, not Undertaker. That's just his best match. So yeah. <laughs> that's his best match. Like he punched his. Like, come on, that's, yeah, that's I good. That's like good. We, we got a lot of him. In no, but I know, like, I know. Like that's he's not hot. Brock Lesnar's. If any, I mean, I think in the beginning, his career, like there like, was a lot of like, because everybody was trying to look like, like uh, Chris, you Sean, like a, you know, once he got Matt older, Hardy, I, they, they all kind of similar, bro. Like, no, he, no, 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 I, I think a brother or something. No, I don't think a brother. Ooh. Christian or something like that wasn't his brother. Oh, no, that was his. No, that's, 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 that's Edge's brother. That's supposed to be Edge's brother. Edge's brother. So I Edge. I mean, I don't know. I feel like he's not as unique. If if we're gonna if that's what we're gonna go with like if Brock Lesnar I think, like, I think it's opposite no I think in the beginning in the beginning of his career I would say because everybody yeah. looked like Sean Mc, like a clone of Shawn Michaels you had Edge Christian all long hair white dudes blonde white dudes <laughs> and then I think he evolved into something like now he the walls uh walls of Jericho or uh, yeah the code breaker the list, the walls of Jericho the, yeah he got the list. list that was I something feel like his, once he got that's older a lot. that's a lot he definitely different yes yeah, Different yeah, he got, himself from he got a whole catalog of just like sayings and things and just he's the first person to beat the rock and stone cold in the same night i know obviously that's like I he know. won the undisputed championship he's the first undisputed champ like he has all these accolades most intercontinental titles of all time i don't know your career last 25 years longevity is great i think he's better brock and if you put brock down i gotta put both of them down if you put i mean jericho down i gotta put both of them down because i think he's better than brock all time Fine by me but I mean, he's not hot. I'm not putting him ahead of like Stone Cold. So, you know. So, if you put so wait wait okay so what's the so what's the concept? What are we doing? What are we doing? It's two to one, so he can stay. Well, well, oh. I would say good career. I don't know. What about you, Marius? What are you feeling? The fact that you, if I if I say good career, you got to bring Brock down. It just only seem like that. Don't seem right. I, I can't I can't have Brock as a good career to me personally. <laughs> you know, like, I just can't. So I rather well, I rather they both just be all time great. Wait wait wait. So well, just, why do you think they both have to come down? Oh, because I believe Chris is ahead of Brock. Chris definitely got to be ahead of Brock. Chris done more for the wrestling business than Brock has. But they're they're two separate entities. I know they're separate entities. We already voted on uh, the Brock. <laughs> we can't just, <laughs> just link them together. What you, I mean, like, I guess he's sending an adjust mean, later. I mean, hey, look, hey, we could definitely, hey, we could, we, I'll put him down for now. But that's like, hey, that's that's definitely crazy to me. But, uh, you know, we think Brock better than Chris. I don't know. That's crazy. It's not crazy. necessarily better. It's just like. More influential, know, more, yeah. Better wrestler, Impactful. better because Chris. Because I, I, I mean, Brock Lesnar. I think, I, like, I guess to the game. I mean, to the. I don't know because I feel like a lot more people know Brock Brock Lesnar. I mean, yeah, they like, know a, a lot, but that's because like, UFC ties. That's because well, I was just in, like in yeah, memes please. and shit like that. Like I just UFC. UFC no, because in, in, really in the wrestling and the Vikings, I just feel like no, nah, he went. Nobody know about the Vikings, but WWE, he was popular. Nobody remember that Vikings. He was. He's very popular, but the UFC is what like when you have WWE and UFC because when he was in the WWE, he eventually he went to the UFC, fought in the match, and that got more publicity obviously because he has that crosshair, he you know goes back and forth. But I would say in just terms of who's a better mic, who's better on the mics, Chris. Oh well, yeah, he's a better in ring, yes. better in ring wrestler on average has higher higher matches on the totem pole. Usually it's Chris. I don't know longevity's Chris. I think Chris, yeah, higher Chris rated like, matches, Chris. So it's like what are we better wrestler? But I think like. But Brock if we're talking like more, more people, if yeah. more people know him, he more he's saying just, I think Brock is still more entertaining. But how is he more entertaining? Look, I mean, every single every single match you're going against is like ridiculous. They squash, they squash matches. They be like in and out. Ridiculous, and people, and that's what, that's why I say it's more interesting. It's quick, fun. I don't know. I wouldn't. Can, can, can you name a, a Brock Lesnar match? Well, I need to. No, I'm just saying they quick and fun. Like, do you yeah, I can one? do that if I look one up. That's fine. Whatever. No, no, no. Hey, no I, 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 I got a couple I can name, but that's because I've been. But okay, who you think better than CM Punk? CM Punk next. You think CM? See, where we going? CM Punk, Chris Jericho. Where we at? Because I feel like those two are similar, 
in terms of their ability to wrestle and their mic skills. Now, we putting Brock ahead of because CM Punk is very iconic. So I don't know where we putting CM Punk at then. <laughs> I mean, people did love him. They adore And this him. is just his WWE career. So once that shit ended, that yeah, shit, right? It's, it's WWE career. But his WWE career, he was... And he ended he had, on the... Very iconic. Five-star match with John Cena last. You could put him all yeah. time great. I mean, he started... Didn't he start off as the villain? Like, then he became the guy know. everybody loved. So, like, he, he had a pretty good career. Yeah, he, was a good, he was a good guy. I and then he, became, he had a beef with Jeff Hardy. Um... He had a really good beef with Jeff Hardy and then began to back out. Terrible him. career. He uh he exposed the WWE. <laughs> put him in I think I think I, I put I put him at good career, man. I put him at good career. I feel like I got I got to me, I gotta link these two close. They're like the same people. If I, if look, okay, if I had to pick between the two, like Jericho and, and CM Punk, I'll probably put Jericho as a as a better career in total totality. So so yeah, we gotta put him at you can't, if, I, you know, if I had to put but like between those two, I would definitely put Jericho. That's so weird though. It's like it's weird to see like CM Punk and Jericho at good and Brock at all time. It's just like they got that's interesting. That just that just weird to me. I got I got be, someone else. I mean it could be like what's that shit called? Not fanboy. Um uh what the fuck is that shit called? Like ca- casual shit. I feel like if you ask somebody who watched this shit like relentlessly more than us who didn't stop, they probably would have had them too. I I wouldn't actually I wouldn't have said them too, but probably Jericho above. Yeah, but but we, like, we, from, we, from we, like we, we, but look, I need clips, so it's fine. <laughs> I need clips, and I need to see what the rest of the community think. I need clips. It's yeah. fine. We put Jericho where we at. <laughs> cool. I need clips. Um, Daniel Bryan, which also is pretty close, I would say, to any of these, like the CM Punk. Uh, They're pretty. Now, Daniel that. Bryan. He's not average. That's crazy. He never heard Daniel Bryan. Wait, for real? Yeah. Are you serious? Daniel yeah. Bryan had that whole yes the thing. Yes, that yeah, the yes went to, It went to multiple sports, too. It was, i seen it in multiple arenas. That's yes. He ain't seen wrestling in probably 10 years, I guess. It's fine, you know? Or not even ten years. Damn, Brian. Oh no, he definitely not forgetting. That yes thing was. No, nah, he's not forgetting. Nah, let me look him up real quick. Yeah, I'm just, look up, yeah, this is a fine. Look him up. What's his name? Daniel, Daniel Bryan. Bryan. Daniel Bryan had a shot of being an all time great, and then he got injured. So I can't put him at all time great no more. He's got to be good. Now I gotta figure out what he who he better than. Um, I might put him. Can I might he be, be between dumb. Trish and not uh, Trish? Um, what's it? Uh, Charlotte and Becky? Nah, I think well, he gotta be. He gotta, he be, gotta be higher than Booker. In terms between, of like between Booker and Batista, or between Daniel Bryan had a main Batista he, and he beat Evolution in one night in WrestleMania. He beat Triple H, Batista, and he beat Randy Orton, and he won the double championship. And then the next night, that that was the most iconic. But I'm like yeah, he had a great career, but his, he fell off because he had injuries. That's what I'm saying. So he yeah, but, he couldn't reach. But maybe okay, you know I'm gonna do. I, I'll do that for you. I think I personally think he should be like here, maybe even here, low key. Cause he, but I'm gonna keep him here just because of the fact that like his 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 peak was like two years, two three years. So I'm I'm gonna keep him lower. Um, Eddie Guerrero, I'm putting him all time great. I, I, lie, I, I cheat, I steal. <laughs> I care nobody say he all time great. I don't, I there's lie. no, there's no like, cause y'all debate that Chris Jericho thing. You can't debate with me, Eddie Guerrero. That's definitely. I lie, time. I cheat, I steal. Yeah, he had a good career. Eddie Guerrero, his gimmick is the best gimmick, probably the best gimmick yeah. I've ever seen. And that. he had the most diverse matches. You know, fighting for custody. Stuff that's, like that's that. That's hilarious. So, that's funny. Yeah, as he shit. Did, he did but is that, I I, is that really him? No, that's more like. I mean, I guess. The, I guess well, he has to say in the story. In the, he has to say in the story, but you know, it's funny. Like I know he said the fight for custody, so now I have to know. I'm pinpointing when John was like with it. So that's 05. So it's like the 05 to 2010. I th- that's like. I think yeah. I think he probably at. stopped around that. He probably yeah, stopped, around, probably stopped around 2008. Did you get when? Like, did you get? Did you get the SmackDown versus Raw games? Yeah. Uh, the last one before. I probably played was um, 09. That's oh, he just stopped away. That's the last time I stopped, yeah. He stopped, he stopped away. That's the one with Triple H and Sean yeah. Yeah, yeah, DX, DX, yeah. DX on it. Damn, 09? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, that's about the time I stopped. Why you stop at? Why you stop when you were thirteen? I'm actually like, yeah, because that's like the best time. Yeah, you stop, I'm, like eleven, like, you're like eleven. Why you stop at eleven years old? You stop like right in the middle of like peak. One you, of those. You know, peak I, I just didn't. I didn't really care for it that much anymore. He ain't like he ain't like the TV PG rating had changed on him. <laughs> um, Edge, I'm also, I would also put Edge all time great. That Ooh, man was an amazing heel, and I hated him a well, lot. I'm cool with you putting him above. I'm even cool with you putting him above. Um, Eddie. what's his name? Not Eddie. Um, Brock. Well, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, I, I, I to me, Brock. he has the best uh intro, the best song. 
Yeah, yeah, he has the best song, I think. Like he's he has a song I could just listen to and not like not correlate with wrestling. It's just like I could just listen to it. Um, I'm gonna put I'll put you at Eddie. I think Eddie long if he was longer maybe. Yeah, he probably would. Yeah. But but Edge, I think just the um and also him coming back the last couple of years and doing his thing coming back the last couple of years that also helps him. We should have went to that Royal Rumble too. That was in Houston and that's when he returned, but I didn't do yeah, it. You would lost your shit. Well, at least you went. I mean, you went to the other one and he he and was I, there. Yeah. Yeah, it was there. Yeah, it was good. Um, this is Shawn Michaels with Shawn his head Michael, cut off. Shawn Michaels is no, but easy, quick, 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 yeah. quick. Don't think we don't think twice. Yeah, don't, don't think too fast. It. It's funny how I knew that was Shawn Michaels. Is that sort of <laughs> weird that I don't have? No, nah, that's sort of weird, dog. But you, you, no, you look not, at his I, I knew it was Shawn Michaels. <laughs> like, I, but like, I don't have to see his face. I just, yeah, I can just look at his body and know what that is. Oh, oh no, it's because of his pants. His pants is very unique to him. It's like yeah, that. Is that? I, I knew it was him too. I'm like that. Oh, okay, it maybe it's definitely. Yeah, can't even think. Don't even think twice. Shawn Michaels clear. Um, now the now the debate now is who's better, Triple H or Shawn Michaels? Triple now that's H. the debate. No, Shawn Michaels. He say, I think Shawn Michaels is better. Michael's I'm sorry. Better. Triple H. <laughs> Shawn Michaels is better. I think Shawn Michaels. And he like the CEO or something like that right now. I know, but like, I ain't, I ain't, he, married, married, uh, he, he married the boss's daughter, yeah, you know. I feel. He fucking the boss's daughter. That's now, Shawn Michael had a better career. I, 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 I mean, I like, well, I don't know. They both got good songs. Yeah, I'm yeah. Shawn Michaels. Yeah. I mean, I can't remember. Like, what's this what like? Has what? Triple H ever had a five star match? I don't think so. No, but I, I think what, Shawn, his his highest rated match was against what John Cena or some shit. Nah, I don't know. It's like who was Shawn, oh, John, Michaels? Shawn Michaels' five star match was no. It was you know it's not the last Undertaker one. It's actually the first one in Hell in a Cell. Oh really? Shawn Michaels versus Undertaker Hell in a Cell was a five star match. There's like there's a scale. It's a Meltzer scale. I think that's the name. And they they rate matches like from one to five. Meltzer. And, Shawn Michaels has a five star. CM Punk's five star with against John Cena. Um, I don't. I, I I stopped looking at the scale, but definitely Shawn Michaels. He had like his, his match versus Kurt Angle yeah. versus the Undertaker versus Triple H versus John Cena. The match he always going like, against like I always feel like he always going against like bigger, bigger wrestlers and like still oh, yeah, holding his own. And he's like holding his own all the time. I can see that. Then he uh, retired Ric Flair. He did, and yeah. Then that was he's an like, iconic moment. Yeah. Right. Was, <laughs> so I hit him in he's a good. He's yeah, good at acting. He's a great actor. Him. Great. He's he's sort of good and on look, the mic too. No, he's really good on the mic. You know why? Because all of Canada hate him. Because when he when he freaking you know they screwed Bret Hart right. You know Shawn Michaels we screwed Bret Hart and then obviously Montreal hates him. And then he they he he trolled all of uh, Montreal because <laughs> he had Bret Hart music come out and Shawn was like, oh my gosh, Bret ain't been in, in, in like for six years. And Shawn was like, oh my gosh, he's back. And everyone in Montreal was so happy. And then he was like, ha ha, I got your hopes up just a little bit. And everyone in Montreal booed him. That was the biggest he had a beef with Hart too. Oh, oh my gosh. Shit. That's heat. Yeah, That's he, how you become a hero. That's heat. Yeah. All right. After all of that, yeah, I'll put him above Triple H. I'll put you here. Hulk, you know, Hulk Hogan in terms of influence is high, but like, I don't, yeah, he, like, he, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I don't want to do that. I don't want him high like that. No, nah, he's not average. I, no, I want to put him average. No, I'm, <laughs> he, he, he all time great in terms of influence. He, I have to put, he, he alleged he all time like I don't know about point. He like the end of. I think the end of. Maybe Eddie. What? Yeah, no, nah, I gotta put him off. He gotta be off. Awesome. Yeah, he's off. Awesome. Put him. I don't know, bro. Like, it's Hulk Hogan. It's Hulk yeah, Hogan. Yeah, I mean, I know, I know, I know, I know that, but like, <laughs> you gotta respect the legends. That's just like with, with Biggie. So he's the most iconic figure. He, I mean, yeah, he on, on there. Definitely top five. He one of the most known people for sure in this list. Hulk Hogan is definitely. You, I mean, people. If know it was Hulk my Hogan. personal list, I wouldn't include him, but. Just as of like a whole, what he did for the community, what he did for wrestling, being a pioneer, you get more points for being a pioneer simply because you're the first to do it. Of course, you're gonna be better the second time around. So you know, of course, they took things from him and involved on it. But he he's definitely up there. Like <laughs> he slammed Andre on, the Giant. He slammed Andre the Giant. He did that oh, little leg drop so out. Yeah. Everybody oh. like ah, that's crazy for the '80s. JBL is one of the best heels. JBL. Oh. His career was peaked quick, but when he did that skit, and it's something you can never do in WWE now. But when he was going, no, when he was going, when freaking um the Mexican border, and he was hunting oh, down oh. illegals, that is something you oh, not do God. anymore. That is crazy. That is a racist, <laughs> and that is a terrible. That is that is heel because I hated JBL. I did too. <laughs> oh my God! My theme song though. Did he have one? Yeah, it was like it was like some uh, it was done. Yeah, it was, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, and he had the limo come out. Yeah, the limo. Right? Yeah, he had the limo come no, out. He, he had the hat. Heel. He's great. He was. I, he's I mean, good wow. He screwed Eddie Guerrero, Guerrero so much, but I was so upset. Great career, dog. <laughs> oh my gosh! 
Uh, where 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 do I put him? Uh, he. Is he like like good he in between? Yeah, I no, 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 above I Daniel. Know. He's not above I mean, Daniel. You know, is, no, I think he's above Daniel. That's what I'm saying. Oh, you think above Daniel? Yeah. I think, I think he's above Daniel. Yeah. Okay, wait. Hey, and the rest of the peers ain't gonna like that. <laughs> the rest of the peers ain't gonna like that way. I, oh, it's available. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Oh, no, I, I, I'm not. I'm no, not no, putting no, him. No, I'm saying I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep him there. I'm gonna keep. somebody wanted, I would keep him there. But if somebody wanted to debate that, I wouldn't. You know, I ain't putting him against my. Wait. Why would they be pissed off about him being more than Daniel? Oh, the wrestling periods because Daniel Bryan one of the best pure wrestlers possible. And, but oh, but oh, we got a guy who now nah, this is gonna be controversial because I know this can go either man. way. That one's tough to me. Who's that? <laughs> it's gonna go either way. Jeff Hardy can go either way. He not. I don't think. Nah, I'm not putting him all time great. I'm definitely putting him all time great. I, I feel like. Hold on, I gotta look bro, at the like, list it. because there's no high flyers. <laughs> let me see. Is there any other high put flyers him, on this uh, list? I mean, let me see. I put, I put him high on good career. I would. I see one. I, I put him like time great. It's just. I don't know. Right. He, he was like he was a hood legend, bro. Like everybody in hood. Legend, <laughs> Not Frodo. No, when, you, when you when you add that context, you gotta you gotta bump that's him up weird. a little bit. He had his little dance, his little hand signals, you know. See, that's that's why I say it's gonna he be had a lot going on. <laughs> the reason the reason why I ain't put him is because that man career should have been. For sure, all time great, but his freaking abuse and his absolute destruction, like use of drugs, because he and this is not in WWE. I'm not, but but he did get cut out of WWE because he kept violating his policy. But when he went to TNA. And he was in the main event match, and he was high as a kite, and he was like literally in the match, just don't know what he's doing, and it's obvious that he can't wrestle, and it's like the most awkward thing ever when you realize this man is like so high, like the guy he was facing to the check, he checked him, like hit him, actually hit him, because he was pissed that he's this high in a main event match. They had to cut off the match, they had, and, and this is like a pay per view main event. He would pay for match. money for that, and this man can't wrestle because he's looking like it's hey them drugs. I can't. Though, look, look, I don't know. Hey, you, babe, y'all got it though. No, I'll no, let y'all. Definitely all time great, bro. I gotta, okay, <laughs> I'm gotta look at it's, it's, it's like we're not here for a long time. We're here for a good time. Hilarious. Like that that little spirit, period. I, I got to see everything. You know, by the time I stop watching, I don't recall him being out of. No, but oh, so. you know, you know, the thing is though, what helps you? What helps it? Because like. It, he ended right when Jeff won his championship. So, like, his last memory is Jeff being successful. He didn't get the rest when Jeff started oh, fall. Yeah. <laughs> he I mean, that's Jeff. it, you know? I'm, There's only, if, like, if that's two. The case, I didn't know about the uh, the incident you just mentioned, so. Like, right as he stopped, he stopped, <sighs> three. and then he fell off. <laughs> that's I don't know. That's don't tough. Know. There's only two daredevils on there I see that's, like, should be all-time great. But I think only should go to one. I'm going to have to give him good good career okay it's just like because just one more of the person on there i think should be all-time great i don't know well, that. i feel like I, he I, should be high but i wouldn't put him above i don't know it is weird it's weird because i do think yeah, he should be all-time question. great i but think he's above <laughs> maybe he's not above booker to me above i don't know that's I between weird. booker between booker and yeah that's Batista. what i was thinking i don't think he's above batista but i do i don't know that's weird I do think yeah, he's that's why, that's great, but he's not that's why it's controversial. okay yeah it's controversial that's why that's the controversy i knew that's there we go John, John, yeah, Tom Great Dog, John, John. That man destroy anybody on the mic too. That man destroy anybody on the mic. That is the most he marketable man. He doing his thing. Yeah, Good for him. What's, a, what's, a, what's his best? Rapping. What's his best era? Thugonomics or Thug? Is that his well, best? Te- no, I think his best era is his early WWE Championship era, like when he had the spinning belt, like 05, oh, 06, yeah. 07. <laughs> I think that's his best time because it's a mix of having that like thugonomics in him. But he also the main event, main character. He got the you know spinning belt. He got them Edge when he had to face Edge and Randy Orton. See those are those are five. Those are classic rivalries versus Edge versus Randy Orton. Those are classic rivalries. So that's what I would put him at his best. And then he started getting shoved down my throat because you know he kept winning all the time and never lost again. But it's yeah, fine. The number one shorts going. I want to say the jean shorts are iconic. I believe when he first. I'm correct me if I'm wrong, but when he first came in, like he. He was kind of like the main character, like from the jump. No, he wasn't. Uh-huh. He wasn't. Uh-huh. No, it took, took, it took a couple years. It, he, his rap thing picked up, and they said, you know, we'll, we'll we'll put him in a match with JBL. They had a whole story about that. I forgot. Yeah, I, I forgot the story he went though. Be the main character. Like the first match I saw from him, I was like, this guy got something going. You probably saw him because that's when he started getting pushed. But like originally, that's I think he, I think he was about to get cut, but he could, but he needed some shit to. Like stick him out, so he started rapping because he was like, "Oh no, I forgot." I think he, he was on a bus in the or some shit, yeah. right? He was in a bus, on the bus. and Stephanie somebody McMahon, asked him. Stephanie uh, McMahon peeped and said, "Hey, you know, you should keep doing that." Yeah, some shit like that. Keep his career alive, and then yeah, that shit boosted him to where he is now. 
It was interesting. And, 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 you know, funny, the best thing about his raps is that at the end, like, if it's a cuss word, so say it's like, it's some, like, I'm not going to say, but it's a cuss word, he lets the audience say it. So he'll, like, oh, yeah. r- he'll rhyme with it. And then at the end, you got to say the last word, you know what I'm saying? So I don't give up. And then he. That's great. My know, skills, hey. That's excellent. Because yeah. he, he can't say it, but y'all can, right? Amazing. Um, Another controversial one. Oh, my man. <laughs> <laughs> we got Kane. He's good career, um, dog. It's good career. Not all time, great. I don't think. I think I think good career. For I sure, think but, he's um, good career, and I wouldn't be biased to say all time great, but nah, I think I can't he, he's a good career. I, now where he I gotta be, be at? He it gotta be high if he, you know. It's either between career. It's either between Batista and Jeff, or Jeff and Booker T. Between those two, I think I, I'm gonna put him. You know, I'm gonna help you out, Kane. I got Batista. You. I don't know. I think I don't he should be all the time. I don't know. Great, I, like, I, and I, Kane, no, like, he's not. Kane, I, I, he had a lot of errors. I, he I he did a lot. I mean, the fire Kane, matches. Like, like, I know what I you know, mean. Man. And it hurts Come too, on, bro. It's, it's not, but it's I, I think. Like, no, because the reason why. The community, like, and he took a lot of L's. He was known he as the ugly guy. No, no, I'm saying like. Oh. Him and then then he had like a little a little time with Lita and everybody was like they shouldn't have been together. And That's hilarious. Just, I, 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 I know, funny, bro. Like, you really, you I, really I, no, look, shit. I it's know. Just funny, like Kane when, was a funny guy, and who's the talk- guy the announcer they used to always talk about him? Oh, uh, he called him ugly, and when he took the mask off, like he had a lot. Oh yeah, I mean, you know, here's the funny thing. No, here's the funny thing because I know when he talked, when John talked, I know exactly where he watching now because he said that when he said that leader thing, I said okay, he 04. so he he around the 04 to twenty. That's hilarious. I know. Okay, I know the period of John. So now that I know what period you watch, now I can tell. But uh, after 08, that man came took so many losses. My my, my brain just like dropped Kane because he took so many okay, losses. Bro. I understand. <laughs> uh, man, I, like, bro, I love Kane too. I actually enjoy. I actually enjoy watching Kane more than Under, Undertaker. To me personally, but like he was scary, yeah, bro. He, like, he and just then not had the little brother thing going. I, he just not he all time great, and I okay. love his his theme song is probably one of my favorite things. I, I think as a character, because like him, like his, no his 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 debut is the best. I think the best debut of all time when he rips the cage off and he interferes with the Undertaker Shawn Michaels match. He rips the, and he's like, "Who is this? This is Kane. It got to be Kane." Then they tombstone his Undertaker, his brother. <laughs> that's that's a that's a great that's a great debut because he's like, "Who is that?" But hey, he had a good career. I, Where am I putting him? Really? Uh, I'm, I'm put. I, I might put him. No, I don't know. He not. I don't oh, think about Batista. Nah, 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 nah. Nah, he, he the L's are crazy. Uh, I don't know. At least Batista. I don't know. I think he it's was Kane, Batista. What we talking about? Kane, bro. <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> we talking about no, Kane. Well, see, like, the thing Kane, is, I was like, watching it so has early. Ever, what was Kane's like main event match? I like. I don't. I don't. Has he ever had a main event match? Did he ever like main event? Did he main event like he uh, burned every like He oh six. He back at 06. I love that he know. I tell him exactly what he watched it. Uh, um, he main event a pay per view match. A pay per view. Well, he's yeah, he's main event. Well, yeah, but you cut out. Yeah, like just now. You muted. You just muted. That's why you just muted yourself. That's the reason why. Oh no, it's just still not working. Yeah, I want it. Oh, there. Hold on. Oh, that's something. I just heard crackle. Testing, testing. You're good. testing. Yeah, you're good. Okay. I don't know. That's interesting. Um, I'm gonna say. Okay. So yeah. So speaking of so Kane, right? And Batista. Now Kane has main evented because he's been in there for 15 years. Ago. Okay. So he's won a championship, but he hasn't won as many as Batista. I don't know. Kane's character is better than Batista. But Batista, I don't know. That's hard. I don't know. That's that's one of the things. I think Batista like, has more, but has better like better matches. Kane like, has a better character, but Batista has better matches and a better like mic presence. I don't know. I know better with like, John. It hurts though. Don't don't look, don't. It hurts. Like I I, <laughs> I I I want I want to put him higher, dog. But I just know okay. it's just not it's just not right. I am. A, oh, what about um SOS? I hear so, them shouting. I put him at so average. stupid. I, I, not, well, you know he has that new day thing, but I don't know. I feel like I want to put him at average because he had that run with the championship and it was such a bust. Is he forgettable? Yeah. No, I said average. I didn't say oh. forgettable. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name again? Kofi no, Kofi Kingston. Kofi. Now this oh, is the, the, uh, okay. I thought you said uh, Shelton Benjamin. Oh, no, so oh, Shelton Benjamin definitely. He definitely should be average. Oh no, no, no. Oh. Yeah, I'll put him at average then. He not really. Where you put him? Uh, at? He above Carlito. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, you know, but he, like, like I said, John stopped bro. right no way. So, but, <laughs> <laughs> John stopped yeah. right no way. I, I remember him though. So. Uh, sh- oh, this is another yeah, controversial whatever. one. And he has longevity. Yeah. He's been he's been a company for a long time. Okay, that's long. cool. 
We got another controversial one. We got Kurt uh, Angle. This should not be controversial, bro. <laughs> okay, well, let me hear what y'all gotta say. Kurt Angle, in terms of being a wrestler, is literally the best wrestler here. Just straight up. Okay, obviously, whoa. he obviously won Olympic gold medal as well with the broken neck. They like to say that a lot. Um, so he best wrestler easily here. Even just in real wrestling, fake wrestling, the best one. His mic skills were also very entertaining as well. Honestly, now nah, I put you know I, I'm I, I would put him at I put him at all time great. Yeah, but y'all definitely. Can, no, yeah. no, it's no. But who will be above though? Uh, he got be if he if he not he got to be above Hulk Hogan, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. I'm almost, I'm almost, if you're not about Hulk Hogan, I'm a personal just... perspective, he is, but like on a objective, I don't know. Like, and we, we get some like, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I want, I want to put him like, I hey, what are you doing? But us, yeah, I want to put him. I don't think I'll put him. I don't know if I put him at okay. Hulk Hogan. I don't think I put him. Like, what, what you're not gonna special? put him above Hulk Hogan? I forgot his I, name. I, I, not the um ankle lock. What was his other special? Like angle, the angle slam. Yeah, didn't he do that to Big Show? He did do that to Big Show, yeah. Right, no, you know, no, no. Funniest thing, he shot Big Show with a tranquilizer, and put him to sleep, <laughs> and, and, they, and, then, and then he he shaved his head bald. I don't remember. I'm, I missed that completely. I don't remember that. I know. Yeah, I remember him shaving him. I don't remember the tranquilizer. Yeah, he, he shot him with the and he. <laughs> that's, on, he wrestling, is, wrestling is good. Boy. Crazy. That's crazy. Wrestling is good. Boy. <laughs> I didn't know that. Um, oh, I didn't see we above. Ed, did him and Eddie have beef? They did have beef. What is going? Are you there serious? No, for real, for real. Yeah, you didn't remember that? <laughs> no, he not, that a, he not going above Hulk? No, nah, I don't think he's above Hulk. I think that, like, Whoa. Kurt Grant, I don't know if he's above Hulk. Like, Whoa. Hulk Hogan, his influence is just too know, high. Yeah. Like, he the Whoa. main character. Hulk Hogan, a main character. Like, I keep, I can't keep putting too many people ahead of the main character. Like, right. the NFL. Hell no. Nah, nah. Really, really, if we being real, Hulk Hogan really should be number two. Like, I mean, in terms of being... Rate. Because oh, Hulk Hogan, shit. That no, because you think it, no, because you think it just Hulkamania, but then he had the NWO as well, and that was like oh, all time great, yeah. all time great faction as well. So I can't, you know, I, I can't put him. Yeah, definitely, yeah, Hulk should be a, hey, but I'm not because I think Sean's just so much greater of a wrestler. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try that. But Lita, um, you can adjust this. I don't know if you want to adjust. Well, Lita's ahead of those. Who was on there? Those two girls, yeah. definitely. So she obviously be. I, I'll Any put other I'll girls just, on there. Trish Stratus. Oh, I see her right there, yeah. But no, I know you know I'm putting Trish Stratus. Oh, but I'm, that's, no, that's, that's the wrong one. One person, one person. But you know he got me on there. So. All right, I put leader right there. Um, somebody about get their ass kicked. <laughs> <laughs> somebody will get their wig split. Oh. I, 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 that thing song amazing. I feel him yeah. good. He not to me. He good, but you can yeah. also think if you want. Yeah, but the Hall of Pain. I love me the Hall of Pain. He threw someone off the freaking. He threw the technician audio guy off the whole. Balcony, whatever it was, I was man. amazing. That man went to the abyss. I said that is great. I loved it, boy. Um, how, how far? Are we, how far can I take him though? Like, how far can I? You can put him low. Can I convince him to go? You could put him. You could put him JBL. lower. Under you could put him. Yeah, you could put him like because Mark Henry didn't win a lot in the beginning because he kept getting injured. But that that 2011 run is just. I'll like, put him in between wow. Jeff, Jeff and Booker. That's how I would put him. I love that theme song. I'd be freaking. I love that theme song, man. I'd be ready to beat someone up with that theme song, but that theme song give me energy. Crazy. Oh, uh, so it's, it's Jeff Hardy's older brother that people do not love as much, but has a great theme song. I, I do love Matt Hardy. Was, I forgot I was his older brother. He was older. Right. I thought he was a younger brother. Yeah, same. that's tough. That means y'all didn't care about the man. Yeah, that, he oh, definitely man. in the back then. He behind his he, brother for sure. Yeah, for sure. He wasn't. I think I put him at average, honestly. And then he got that, his girl too. He liked the. He what? He got his you know, girl you know, too. You know, oh, but you know, oh, because okay. because Edge was a superhero. But yeah. look, at the end of the day, you know, Matt did well. His Matt he wife, so he got he got he got a wife, <laughs> and then and then Edge, you know, obviously got a wife. Yeah, Leaders by herself. They should have mixed. Oh. They should have Jeff and Matt should have mixed their careers. Like they mind if they, Jeff oh. if Jeff would have just you know stay, stayed off drugs and had the same trajectory. They they they, they yeah they would have been well, but you know they didn't. Damn, because they weren't no, but, tag team partners for a while, right? The Hardy Boys, yeah. You know, they messed up because um, I remember the Edge Matt Hardy beef and then they let Matt Hardy write his own script when he was coming back because mm-hmm. it was like, you know, edgy because it's like, oh, you know, Edge took his girl. Now Matt's pissed, you, you know, running backstage, beating up Edge and all that. And he was mm-hmm. like, he, he started saying they real names too. He said, Amy, calling Lita, Adam, calling Edge. He said, and I hope you die in a car accident. And I was like, oh, shucka, shucka. Oh, That's you're not crazy. supposed to say that on live. You shouldn't say it on live TV. That was tough. That was interesting. Yeah, oh, I, man. Man. I, 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 I put I, some I, respect on his name. I kind of disrespecting him a little bit. I think I, he, he, Matt he Hardy is still up there. It's, I think he on average. I don't think he, I don't, I don't uh, know. Or, I, I think he in between Lynch um, and uh, Charlotte. We can play everybody a good career, I feel like. <laughs> I think he, I, I think he, like to me, I think he here. Because okay. I feel like, that's what I think. You think he had I'll, a better career, or Charlotte got a better career than him? 
Yeah, Charlotte, multi-time champion. Matt Hardy never won no WWE championship, World Heavyweight Championship. I never watched Charlotte, so I, I, Matt, I don't know what you like did. Matt Hardy never been in a main event. He won Intercontinental, yeah, but he never was in a main event match for like in a in a pay per view. I mean, he's not somebody I'm, I'm gonna argue for. So they would, yeah, they, I mean, they do He was no TLC match or anything. They didn't push him like that. He not <laughs> <just>. <laughs> they didn't play him in no TLC match. Are you serious? No, he's in a, he's uh, in a he, TLC I'll match, him, but he not but, he not in the uh, main event. He's never been. I have never, and I'm not talking about TNA Matt Hardy delete delete because that'd be different. Oh, but okay. WWE Matt Hardy. He has never. I don't recall ever him being in any main event pay per view match. Do you think he above Kofi? Is that because of yeah, longevity? Like, uh, I think he is above Kofi. Yeah, I'll say he's above Kofi. Yeah, but at I, the same I don't time, say, you know, I stopped watching. So yeah, he stopped right at the. <laughs> <laughs> he stopped. No, you can switch it back. You can switch it back. Yeah, I yeah, that Kofi, makes sense. Because Kofi, Kofi, Kofi wanted the championship. Yeah, I'm gonna switch you back. I got you. He got a push. Okay. Matt Hardy never got a push. Besides this, the, besides, besides literally this picture of him, which is him saying, "I want um." Adam to die in the car accident. Literally, this is the picture. That's funny as shit. Mick Foley got to be an all time great. Yeah, he's all time great, dog. 100%. He do, he do, he do. That was all the daredevil I was thinking of. Wait, wait, where you put him at, though? Yeah, I, I, bro, I know you. Uh, y'all are this whole thing. That's tough. Yeah, yeah, I mean, he did a lot for. I think he did a lot for wrestling too. He took a lot of L's. And he took a lot of hits. Cell. So, I um, think he got to be. He did the barbed wire stuff. I, I think like nails. Right here. He, yeah, he he. Fuck, there. bro. Y'all, I, yo, Hulk Hogan. Got Wait, where, like, where you want to put him at? <laughs> bro, he got to be a, like <laughs> all these bumps that he took, and he not above Hulk Hogan. But Hulk Hogan, <laughs> bro, he never. I don't, look, look, no, he Hulk Hogan NWO stuff and like his. I don't know. I mean, Maurice, I'll let you do. You know, Maurice, since Hulk you got Hogan this, you got he, you got a vendetta. Races. That's hilarious. You got a vendetta against Hulk Hogan. So what I'm gonna do. Mick, I'll let you put where you want to put Mick Foley. At? Uh, he gotta I'll be above. Like, he gotta be above Hulk Hogan to me, dog. What about Edge? Wait, wait, with Edge? No, nah, he's not above Edge. No, nah, he's right there. Now. I know. That's, see, that's I know, right in see, the middle. Nah, I see, like he, I know. If we, if he gonna uh, Edge, no pun intended. If he gonna Edge Hulk Hogan, then I feel like he should be above Edge. Let's get it. <laughs> I like Maurice. You gotta be. You gotta go for it. You just because, stop where you got to say. No, nah, I just, I just, <laughs> no, I just wanted him to be. I because it's Hulk Hogan. I, I, I just can't sit right with him being above, being behind Hulk Hogan. Mick Foley had a match with Edge, that, that hardcore match. That match was, like, really violent, and it finished with them both being in fire. And obviously, Mick Foley's taking most of these bumps. So Mick Foley definitely... and jump, Did Triple H take bumps, too? No, I mean, well, Triple H took some bump, but wasn't like... Like, Triple H, what, he lifted up Mick Foley, and he fell through the cell. Undertaker threw Mick Foley off the cell. You know, Mick Foley got spirit through fire. I think, the Rock look, hit him 10 times, 11 times he in the head with the steel chair. Obviously, Hulk Hogan more iconic. But I think Mick Foley is, he's done a lot of things for this company. But see, that, that, that was my like that, and he and it's it's almost to a point he's done so much for this company that it can't be done no more because obviously that, it's PG now. But that that was my argument with Chris Jericho and Brock. Like Brock more iconic, but Chris Jericho did more for wrestling. I don't know, but that's just more, back, that, it, it, that's even more. Back. That's more. That's more of Hulk Hogan though. That's more. That's, that's more. That's more <laughs> to me. So I don't know. That's more to me than that. Because that's that's literally I'm doing what you did, but with for Brock and um Chris, but. I feel you though. Even, I, I, I put even him ahead. That, even with that, he does more, and his matches are entertaining though. So it's still a mix of both. Like, but his I, I, matches I, are definitely entertaining. But I'm here. For, I put Mick ahead for you. <laughs> I did it for you because you were Hulk Hogan. Not being like you, like oh my gosh, Hulk says so I did it crazy. for you. Um, this is my man the Miz? I, mean, it has to be I the came. Miz. To, I, I came to play. I'm. Oh no, uh, but look. Now, John, now, 08 Miz ain't it, though. So he going to think Miz is forgettable or something because 08 Miz ain't it. You got to go to 2010, 2011 to get some years <laughs> in. <laughs> yeah. So so his, his opinion, he going to obviously put him low. I yeah, think no, Miz. Definitely forgettable. Oh, damn forgettable. Bro, no, but look, but, where but, I stopped at, definitely forgettable. But, but wow. think, look, remember, no, Maurice, think, remember, 08. The Miz won the guy in 08. So was this he last married, memory. Was he married to? Uh, no, he wasn't. Or? He wasn't. He, he wasn't he married wasn't to Maurice or whatever her name was. He wasn't yet. Nope. Damn. So 08 Miz ain't him. He with John Morrison. You know what I'm saying? So oh, he ain't shit. him. I forgot about John Morrison. Uh, I don't know where he would be at. Uh, good career. I don't think all time great. I think, I, I think he's he not. Nah, nah, he not. Come on, good career. I no, I mean his career. career. No, I think he, he. But I don't know. He like he's an extremely high average. No, you know what I'm gonna do. I'm put. You know I put him at average because he fell off. Really, like he was good. But then when when Snoop Dogg beat him at WrestleMania, <laughs> I know that I, I know they did like an audible because Shane McMahon blew his legs out. But I don't know. It's it's kind of like true, yeah. But man, like I don't know. Does he even I mean, wrestle like that? I thought I thought he was just like 
I know. I don't know. Uh, it's 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 here. It's it's like it don't matter. Football coin fresh. I don't. It, it, I, I'm gonna do what you do. Um, if it's even, and then we'll put him on good career. Okay. It is even. Good job, buddy. You at the bottom. I hear voices in my head. There we go. Where is he at? He's obviously up here. So yeah. where is he at? I'm gonna be I'm gonna be biased to all that? this Hulk Hogan shit, dog. Is, is, is he above Edge? <laughs> Who's a better heel, Edge or Randy? That's a good question. Who's a better heel, Edge or Randy Orton? And John, you got you got good heel versions of them too. It's not like you had to wait. The, you know, by this time, you got good versions. At that time, well, from like where I start, I would put Randy Orton. Yeah, he was a big like, killer at the time. Like, he, yeah, what? he was he was kind of rival to. And he got the RKO out of stuff. nowhere too. Yeah, and the RKO is yeah, you're right. That, that's super nowhere. iconic. I mean, Edge is he had to make fun better. Is he had to make fun? Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I don't I like think I give it to him. I give it to him. Legends, like I could give it to him. <laughs> and they had a good date. That match between them two was actually fucking dope too. Yeah. So it was. Yeah. I won't dispute yeah. it, but I just I feel like if you're a legend, like you gotta. He took I'm bumps. always edge the legends. Great, great, like of, great main events. He was cool on the mic. Had an iconic uh, finisher. What's his That's best like rival? His best rival. Is John Cena? Yeah, it probably got me. Yeah, I think John Cena. John Cena. Triple like H. A, Did he go to Triple H? Yeah, but I don't know. They, they could have done that better. They they could have like when they had their match. What well, John? I'm curious. Wait, you you stopped watching before WrestleMania was in Houston? Why? Like literally, WrestleMania was gonna be in Houston. Probably a couple months later. You, but I'm pretty sure you didn't watch that. Or yeah. know of that, so why'd you stop? Literally, when like the biggest event <laughs> is coming to your city, I didn't even know it was <laughs> coming to Houston, honestly. Yeah, that man Maurice, he got commended performance to watch that thing on all my all my tax stuff, dog. I didn't go, <laughs> yeah. no, I didn't go though, but I watched pay per view. I remember George Cole, shout out to George Cole. He went to because you know he was able to go backstage. I was looking at you, you stud. <laughs> my, my my dad, he tricked me. I my dad that. said, um, my dad said he bought tickets, and I was so excited. And then he said, Nah, I'm just kidding. I almost wanted to jump off the cliff. That's freaking stupid. Why you tell an 11-year-old kid that? Um, tough. Damn. Booyaka, booyaka. Now, Ray Mysterio, that could be... That, no, you know what? I'm going to put you higher. I would have stopped you. I almost would have stopped you at a good career, like really high, but then he came back with and had the little with thing. With his son? With his son, and he fine with his son. Now, that that that, that to me gets you... Now, is he better than Eddie Guerrero, though? Because a lot of people say the reason Ray Mysterio got that push in the first place is because Eddie Guerrero passed away. And no, they don't like that push. That push wasn't as good as you remember. It's just the match was good. And John, I, mean, I know you're he, around. You're, you're at this time because John, now we, we're here with your time. Yeah, um, I <laughs> mean, he was being pushed I, for I put him there though. just because he what, was getting pushed what Kane did he, to him. But they had the whole they had the whole custody shit, so he wasn't even getting pushed for girls. I mean, that's like that. yeah, but that's not like yeah, that's him versus I'll, Eddie. Eddie wanted to wrestle him. It's yeah. like a slingshot, like you know, he he projected off of Eddie and went to the top. Uh, I mean, look, I don't know. Uh, that he kind of another hood classic. I mean, a hood legend too. Like no, he, everybody, he had all time great, you know yeah. what I'm saying. And then he did the thing with Kane. I thought he was dead for real. Well, I thought he was dying. You remember that when uh, you know, remember that scene? No, wait, let me let me see. Was it because I, I I'm trying to readjust. I'm trying to okay. okay. Oh, you talking about Greg Khali? No, 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 no. Khali. it was Kane. Like Kane, oh, what did Kane do? Was that him? I think when when he's bleeding out oh, of his was that mouth, Shawn Michaels? and when he's squishing his no, head. I know the Greg Khali squished his head, but it was I think right. it was Kane who put the chair around his neck. And then he jumped off oh, no. the top. Kane, 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 Kane did that to Shawn Michaels. Kane did that to Shawn Michaels. Oh, uh, Shawn Michaels. Okay. No, but yeah, I, yeah okay. it's still, it's still, right. it's still, we're still, right. we're still consistent. It's 04. <laughs> we're still consistent with John. I know. Well, I could have sworn, sworn that was Rey Mysterio. Because the reason why I know, because like when he him, said, go ahead, go ahead. I'll, I'll, I'll give him above Eddie. You do I, it for real? I'll, I'll give him above Eddie because uh, I feel like I feel like Eddie would probably want that shit. I feel like he had a like. I mean, I think this Eddie will probably be way higher. Obviously, for what. If it, what what happened didn't happen, but uh, I'll give it to him. I think I think he 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 passed expectations, even with that I, push. I'll tell you, look, I I I'll give it to y'all. But Eddie's last match, that cheating stuff when he throws the chair, he hits the ground with you the mean chair. Like his, literal, the chair. his literal That's last, last match? match, like his literal match. like of life. You mean yeah. that that one? Yeah, he oh, okay. hits the ground, throws the chair to Mister Kennedy. You know, I don't think I didn't put Mister Kennedy, but those the throws a chair to him, falls to the ground, and when the referee's like, that that is just like, that for my age, especially, that's peak entertainment. That's like, oh, he's so clever. That is just like, that's so entertaining. I'm, I'm, I'm going to do it for you. I got y'all, though. But I, I think Eddie, I, I, I think Eddie better, but I'll put him in. They had a good rivalry, too, because Ray kept beating Eddie, cause, and then Eddie got really pissed and exposed this whole, you know, child thing. Um, Woo! I'm putting, you know, this is number one. This got to be number one, but I'm going to let y'all think. This got to be, because he's got to be number one. Okay, I'm going to say, if he's not better... 
This was this this is when I think of Hulk Hogan. This is the like, <laughs> he the Hulk Hogan to me. Like to what like it's him. Like yeah, he's he's definitely one. above uh, Mick Foley. He's they, I Hulk think Hogan I think number one to me. I think number one. I think he influenced Sean and Triple H obviously, and then like Ric Flair sixteen time tied with John Cena all the time and just like then it is I, I think I think number one. Yeah, but cool I, with that. okay, like I said, he he is the Hulk Hogan. What, 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 what y'all think of Hulk Hogan? That's that's him. Oh no! But now we got we got our guy. We got the we got the tribal chief. Now we got some John got like little knowledge with me. If, now if Austin was here, Austin oh, yeah, would be like, "Boy, you're not here, right?" No, he's not here. Um, Roman Reigns has had an all time like Roman Reigns up to like 2019 was very very mediocre, Roller but then his last three years is just like an all time great run. They pushed him. He's the face of the company, the main character, but he's a heel main character. That's not often. You don't see that all the time. Heel main character. He hasn't been pinned. He got pinned just now, but he hadn't got pinned uh, in like three, three years. years. He has his championship for over a thousand days. It's almost that's like five fifth most all time. He beating up Brock Lesnar and he beating all these other. Hey, he might no, be, I'm yeah. not. I, I, okay, okay. How long was um AD Guerrero wrestling before he passed? How, how long was that? In WWE or just in period? Or WWE, oh, like WWE. maybe like six, seven years? Six years. And I'm, I'm just going with Roman Reigns just like. No, I have to go off his whole career. I was just go off his 2019 shit. Just from 2019, like, I have to go off his whole career. Yeah, his whole career, obviously. Even the shield, I mean, the shield thing was sort of, was corny, but the shield was like, really no. The shield was, but good. it was alright. It was good. It was the shield was a good faction. Like for the two years, of, and then you know, obviously whatever happened. But then after the shield, like you know, they he was terrible. Like they didn't like him. John Cena bullying him. Everybody, he wasn't good. And then he was supposed know, to be he was, it was a roller coaster. Cena. Like it's it was he was peak. It yeah, went but, down. And, now he's like super high. Super but these no these these yeah these last three years, but he they peaking with the best of all time. But is that amazing. like is that pushing him? I'm well. I'm trying. To, I think he's all time great. But I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna put him. It's like is he, he above he, Eddie he or in like a head, or like in between Eddie and Brock um, or maybe behind Brock. I don't know. I think I think, no, I think he had a Brock. I think he had a Brock. <sighs> See me, he had a Brock at this point. He hit a thousand a thousand day years, rain like yeah thousand eight. days. So he played. He, he's Matt eight years. Eddie, so he got. I think he's in between. Yeah, I give it to him in between because Eddie's. I'm gonna think turn off. Even his eight years was, was probably a little bit better than uh, Roman Reigns. All right. Well, yeah, I'm putting. Okay, so let me let me do this. So you said you put him ahead of Eddie, or you put him? You put no, him no, here? no, behind it. Oh, in behind, between. Oh, behind it. Okay. In between. Um. Yeah. There. Well, they say they say his storyline the best in years, and I agree. It's actually very entertaining. Um, Shane O'Mac. Definitely put you at. I'll put you in the average area. Yeah. Definitely the way he blew his quad was hilarious. That's he was very. Funny though. He, he took some. He took bumps though. That man dropping off fifty feet and the coast to coast with the trash can in the face yeah, was obviously bro. very entertaining. And John, do you remember the rivalry with DX versus the McMahons? You remember this? This your this your time. We here. Yeah, I remember so, yeah. That. You, you remember that? So that was entertaining. The Hell in a Cell match. He had, his, he had his moments, but I mean, I wouldn't put him with the other guys. So I'll put him so, average. Where would you put him Above, on? Above uh, Carlito, I guess. Yeah, I see that. That's, I, yeah, that's I why I, I mean, he had his moments, but it's just. Yeah. Oh, now we got we got a banger here. It's Stone Cold, because Stone Cold obviously it's Stone Cold. We put him ahead of Ric Flair. We put him ahead of John Cena. What you doing? Hold on, my phone. Um, Stone Cold. I put him ahead of John Cena at least. At least. Uh, I'm gonna go with Stone Cold at least. He gotta be top three. Yeah. Who am I push okay, three. I feel like Shawn Michaels gotta go higher for some reason. John Cena gotta be four for some reason. <laughs> like, Shawn Michaels amazing, but what? I think Shawn Michaels. <laughs> I, I think Shawn crazy. Michaels. I think Shawn Michaels to me, Shawn, he's my favorite wrestler. Shawn Michaels to me is like the best wrestler in terms of just like all the whole package put together. But in terms of like the marketability, I think I, I had to put just to take away bias. Like I put John ahead of Shawn in my mind because it's like. The marketability and the fact that John was always big match John. He was always in all the big matches. True. Like, but uh, no, he's but a, the he's he number two. Two. He's, I, he I, put Stone Cold number two. Okay. Yeah. Two. Where you put him, John? Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh wait! Wait! Oh, because we got a cooker right after. Say, so, hey, look, my, this, who's, now, this, now this is my who's favorite. Better? <laughs> this is my who, favorite. No, he's three. I don't. I don't better? know, bro. Like, no, he's in three or four. Too. It is debatable. I mean, Rick Flair did a lot too. So, like I said. Oh, I guess they're both legends, so it don't really matter. Yeah, you can leave it how it is. I think now we got the Rock. <laughs> yeah, who, who, who's better, the Rock or Stone Cold? Oh, no, we man. got we got a we got I'm, a cooker. Man, I, you know, I'm, 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 I'm,
Cause I mean, The Rock, he was better on the mic. Uh, Stone Cone had his like little uh, sketches and skits and stuff, where he go around in the crowd and ask, "Who are you and what do you do for a living?" And like, oh, that was that was fun. Yeah. <laughs> he had his I don't know. And then with the beers, Stone Cold's or, finisher, Stone Cold's yeah. finisher is the most amazing. And but The Rock's selling of it is also hilarious. It's also good. So you, yeah, the, <laughs> the Rock is the funniest. As a wrestler, man, the Rock, you can have a full minute catalog or hour catalog of the Rock and his sayings and what he did and his most yeah. funny entertaining. I feel like when he, he, if you want to show somebody the wrestling, I feel like if you want to show somebody wrestling, you would show him the Rock. Would, but you you show him the Rock talking, but you show Stone Cold like hitting somebody in the corner when, he, when he's like stomping a mud hole. That's <laughs> I mean, he, he has to pick his elbow, the Rock bottom. I'm, I'm going to put uh, the Rock above him just because he had like the... I liked his. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I don't know. When I, 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 I used to play the games and I used to do the people's elbow like that. But that move, like, but yeah. the thing about that move is like you can't sell it as well because it's like that move don't do nothing. But Stone Cold Slaughter, like, you, like, you get to interact though. with the crowd though. Yeah, like, it's you, the setup. You, you got to take like, the so. armband oh, but, like, off and you you looking into the crowd I'm like ah, it's your it's, it's your setup. moment, bro. And, it's and, like, like, <laughs> and then he kick his arm off. He, he like he'll yeah, kick, he kick your arm. But but the only reason you could do that. It's because you couldn't do the stunner setup when he flick you off. He freaking flicks you from behind and he kicks you <laughs> and he stuns you because you. <laughs> and that's that's true, bro. I, I don't know. Like I just think the rock bottom was cool too, but the okay, like, okay. Was, how like, about this? This one looking to the crowd. So what makes a good wrestler? So you got Mike, uh, finishers, um, gimmick. Like I guess gimmick. What else? Also what like else? in in ring in ring in ring. Like yeah, have them actually, uh, how well they do. What else? Anything else? That's, that's usually it. But like, okay, so who who has a, the they, better they gimmick? They neck and neck, bro. <laughs> they're, they're, they're pretty. The better gimmick, I think, is, is Stone Cold. Yeah, Stone Cold. I, 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 Stone Cold got Stone a better, better gimmick. gimmick. But the thing, here's the thing about it, though. But there's no, like, dif- the, the difference ain't strong. because like, Stone Cold has a better gimmick, but, but not that much. The I, Rock no, no, has no, a no, better mic, but he's, Stone Cold's also great. It's like, it's... Well, that's what I'm I saying. Think, oh, what, what about theme song? What about theme song? That's also oh, yeah, that's, theme song. that's five as well. You do five. How did the Rock theme song go? I forgot. It was like dun 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 dun. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm going with the rock. And Stone no, Cold no, look, Stone Cold like with the, the, with the glass. glass breaking. Breaking. No, yeah. the glass no, that's shit. fire though. That's, that's fire, boy. When he walk out and he talking, he about to beat everybody ass in the ring. Dude, he talking to Stone himself. Cold coming that's crazy, bro. I'm sorry. I don't know. Stone Cold. I think Stone Cold better. Stone Cold, bro. I don't know. Better, better, yeah, I think he has a slightly better gimmick. He has a slightly better song. Slightly better finisher. And hey, Stone Cold two to one in the Rock and WrestleMania matches. Damn, Stone- that's <laughs> I mean, the Rock, the Rock has the best mic skills ever. So, but the Rock, and that push, and that pushes him higher. But I don't think so. I but think Stone he- Cold, go ahead, go ahead. And what, there was another thing that we said that that also. Made- oh, and like in game wrestling, or and, and I think I think I'll give I'll give it I'll give it to Rock for like in game because he he he's a best seller. He's one of the best sellers. So I give him like I think it's three two. What turn if you will pick those five categories. I think Stone Cold has three of those, and The Rock has two of those. I'd say The Rock did the best job in being a heel than Stone Cold because when The Rock was a heel and he had that when he bullied Sacramento when he when he was singing on the That's guitar, skills, yeah. that is the funniest thing. Or he bullied Toronto. He kept we just went to your city and bullied you. That I think having a, having my skills is the hardest thing to accomplish as a wrestler. Cause he had to control. Cause I showed my girl. My girl don't care for none for wrestling. She was like, I don't want to watch this. But when he she, when he was roasted Toronto, she was like, Dang, he. Yeah, they. Yeah, I love that. I I, I put him. I put him right behind. But it's it's close. It's close. Know. No, it's yeah, super close. Man, I mean, that's like I it said, really is. They probably the most evenly matched as far as like talent wise as you can get. So they're like one A one B definitely. Hey, good timing, right? Good timing. Add to the era, friends. Hey, if you were yeah. in Add to Era, good job. Good timing. Good time. Good old time. Who's All right, well, Trish? Trish Stratus, obviously, I think Trish Stratus should be. She all time great. I think she all time great. Okay, I think she yeah, obviously. I think she the lowest. Wait, wait, is she the one that kiss uh, Mickey Jane? Oh like, yeah, he Mickey, in that segment. Yeah. Oh six, yeah. <laughs> 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 like, well, oh, Mickey, oh, no, no, Mickey kissed her, and you gotta remember at that time that was like before. Yeah, I'm trying to watch my wording because you know we're in a different climate now. But at that time, it was like it wasn't as being gay wasn't it was, as, it was more crazy. Know, yeah, it was being a, gay it was, was like. We were more so strict was, as a community. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody. So when she did that, it was like the craziest thing I ever saw as a kid. I'm like, she, like, I thought about it for weeks. No, she was just, like, she's, oh, she's she all time great. She had that was under great. the mistletoe, I think. All yeah. Time great. That, yeah. Hey, hey, yeah. Trish, uh, it's good. There. Yeah. Trish, that, that was a good rivalry. You know, the fun, like I told you, when um, I can't do this because I'm going to get, I'm not getting demonetized. I'm gonna <laughs> but like, um, yeah, when Mickey James fight, faced Trish in their WrestleMania and then Mickey James, 
or to grab Trish in the crotch area, and they did a sexually explicit, um, you know, you know, with their hands to her the, tongue. The, yeah, the pussy shit. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then they were so pissed. They she went backstage, and they did not like that. They said, "What the hell? Oh, are you he, doing? she was supposed to do that. Of course not. That was uh, like off the dome. She said, "Let me Wait, really." What year, what year was this? Push this character. Oh six. And think she gonna do that during this time? No, I mean, yeah, but that's still like we's TV fourteen. We didn't expect you to do that. Okay, we didn't expect you to do that. I will have to. I will have to bleep that shit out. I mean, okay, video drop. Now, okay, here's a good one. Where is Don? Don? Don, Don, Don. Y'all, y'all probably not gonna like this, but to me, he number one. Undertaker. Yeah, he uh, had a Stone Cold Rock yeah. and Ric Flair. Yeah, yeah. I, think, anyway, I, I just feel like he went through two different eras, and like he he bridged our era. As well, and like he, I don't know, because I remember it was some, I can't remember the uh, the wrestler, but somebody was, I saw it on TikTok, the guy was like, uh, he had to go to Undertaker, and Undertaker was allow him to get back in the um, the locker room, pretty much. Like the guys didn't let him go in oh, the yeah, locker he, room. He, he, he was the he was the leader. Undertaker was like, like, a, he's like he was the, the conscious, godfather, if anything. He was the conscious of the backstage. <laughs> he was definitely the leader back there. Like, if you had that much impact. Oh. On the actual wrestlers, and then you gotta remember the fans. He had a huge impact on us as well. To me, it, I, I don't think number best. one. Great he has the best song gimmick and time. like gimmick. He was the definition of a gimmick. Like the Undertaker, he's the best like, gimmick. Yes, he has the like, best gimmick of all time. Period. That uh, when he rises up after being knocked down, the lights flashing. Oh, because when he faced know, uh, like, when he faced Randy Orton, that's yeah. a. And then like they have made meme that too. Like <laughs> smoking his, from the coffin, he like. <laughs> That shit funny as oh, shit. Oh, because he the one that had the coffin matches, right? Yeah. So, like, like, bro, I don't Did know. Did he bury somebody? Who did he bury? I know he, like, you literally know, buried somebody. Match. It was on. You you cut out again. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you see. Yes, you. There you go. You hear me? Yeah, I can yeah. hear you now. All right, well, Kane buried Undertaker. I don't think I'm doing Kane buried Undertaker, so. Nobody else got buried in the gravel? Usually, Undertaker was the one getting buried. <laughs> I thought he buried. I thought Undertaker buried I somebody. He might, he might. I mean, Undertaker. Well, he probably got buried. You know, for y'all wrestling enthusiasts, enthusiasts, he probably got buried sometime in the nineties. You know what I'm saying? But um, from the last buried alive match I could recall, yeah, Kane buried the Undertaker, the Dead Man gimmick, and then that brought back the um, not the Dead Man, yeah, the you know the bike, bicycle, bicycle gimmick, and then brought back the Dead Man gimmick. But yeah, Undertaker. Um, I would I, put him. I could see, I could see, I could see your push for number one. I could sort of see it, but I don't know about. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't put him number one though. I wouldn't put him as Stone Cold Rock, even though he's more. Like, he's not. Well, I would say uh, the reason I was because longevity. Like he's just been doing this shit for like, well, obviously not anymore, but like twenty plus years. He just been it's, doing this. It, 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 it and like, though, it Rock stopped away. to go obviously go pursue other shit. No, I can't put him in those. I'm sorry, I can't put him as Stone Cold Rock. I, I think know. he he got to be above John Cena. I, you can put him at John Cena if you want to. You can do that if you want to, but. I can definitely see your push for number one, without a doubt. That is close though. Like if you're if you're this high, like maybe a maybe one extra world championship or one extra good rivalry away. You know, if I if I I would put it like if it was like really close, I would put him between Stone Cold and Rock, just because of longevity and how long he was doing. Fair enough. Okay, now now John, we have to push you this side. Because we got a guy, Seth Rollins. Oh, okay. I, I couldn't tell who that was. I thought it was Macho Man Randy Savage at first. I was like, oh, <laughs> we not that old. Um, but John, definitely, you don't have, you can't have any really opinion of this at this point. He was not in this in a way. Good Seth career. Rollins. Right, yeah, I put him. I put him. He's like career. a good career. But I put him. Um, I don't know where he'd be at though, because I don't. Not, no, you know I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a safe for y'all now. For you WWE fans, now we know Seth. Well, I know Seth Rollins is an amazing, amazing character doing great things. So if we put him too low, you could cook those two. Not me. Not John. You don't know. Cook yeah. more Maurice. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I know he was part of Shield. No, no, but he his career is pretty. Like, now he has the best money in the bank cash in of all time. What I'm gonna oh, do? He's running that shit fire. Yeah. That is this fire. But what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put him at a safe spot. Put him safely right here. Right. Now, I know everyone who watches wrestling now will say there's no way JBL had I know you're going to say that. I know you're going to say it, but don't blame me. I'm just trying to appease these guys right now because <laughs> I know they don't know him. So I'm like, there's no way he better Mark Henry JBL. But look, I know. So don't cook me. I don't, right? know, I don't know, bro. Yeah, I'll keep it up. I don't, I don't yeah, we'll keep it. I don't really care enough. Ain't no way I'm letting him I don't really care enough. I was like. Look, because look, look, I know he, he, he could be and probably should be hired, but. They don't have enough data on that, so we're not gonna we're, not, we're gonna just keep him right there at a yeah. safe spot. Definitely. Um. So he's definitely better than Daniel Bryan. I mean, he should, he a lot he brought a lot of people here, but I'm not gonna even. So we won't him. accept it. But where are you saying he should go? Um. 
I'm not going to put you at Booker T. I might put you like, you know, if, you know, should I put, nah. If it's only probably, two above, then that's fine. I, I, I'll put you here. It, it, it's okay. arguable here, but I'll just put you here. That's that's even better. I think I think that I could appease you, WWE fans. Um, Vince McMahon is a character and as a visionary, obviously, is all-time, all-time great. All-time great. <laughs> now, where do you put him? Bro, all-time coming great. up, well, are we talking about just wrestling or like No, but like his, his, his character. No, but I'm not going to put it. I'm not even gonna bro, put his like. So funny, bro. Like, but his character is <laughs> hilarious, bro. He got, he got a great character. He's so funny. Oh, he the just like the matches he came up with, the ideas. Like, no, he's on. He's up there. Yeah. But if, if I if I if I don't if I don't count his like backstage work, if I count his in ring, not just not even because oh, oh, obviously, oh, yeah. but, but he's not in, for... on the screen. Okay, I got yeah, you. on the screen. Yeah, but I got, I got a, what you're saying. But as a okay. character, he's still like he's an amazing he's still, character. Wait, 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 wait. Are you, he has are you talking about physically wrestling or like Mike's? Like just him Everything. on screen. Like, just every... like when we see him, you know, the behind the scenes is when him. Oh, okay, when yeah, I still think I, even with that, I still think it's all if we're doing no, behind all the great. scene, then he would be yeah. number one because all the matches great. he came up with. But I think he just talking about like when he's on the screen and then you know he's arguing with John Cena or somebody like that, or Shawn Michaels and or DX, Shawn like... Michaels, <laughs> or you're fired. Yeah, just like when he was. When we saw him on the screen doing work, I think he also put him there. I think I was put him out though. That man fired his daughter, and he freaking <laughs> that man it, yeah. <laughs> beef with DX. Is. Said the N word too, so he did say. And you know, yeah. the crazy thing back in 0- 0- 07, he said that right to me. That wasn't like that wasn't that crazy, even though it was crazy. But it was like, I don't know, I don't know why my mind didn't correspond. That I was like, okay, mm-hmm. but now I hear that, and I'm like, that's the he said that, huh? Said that's it. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> he yeah, just, he yeah, he. I don't know. Just um, every okay. time he was on the screen, it was entertaining. I think I'd put him. Ay, ay, ay. I don't know. That's hard. Well, just Probably, put, him at, uh, put him at the end. So, so, let me just see what it look like. Yeah. Nah, he can't be this low. Okay, no. I, I have to see what it look like. It, okay, nah, he got be. I'm gonna put him. He had, he at least had a Kurt Angle right now, and I'm you can adjust from there. But definitely he not. No, his rivalry with Stone Cold is literally what this literally made Stone Cold how great he was is the fact that because it was relatable. Like he hates his boss, but we can't beat our bosses up. That's illegal. He, but he uh, can put <laughs> it. No, uh, yeah. When he was in the hospital, he hit him he with a pan in his head. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, he t- he took a lot of L's too. So and yeah, then I ain't gonna lie to you. You better hope Hulk Hogan. When they make the midget his son. Bro, that I'll, put was up, I'll put him above Hulk Hogan. You know the funniest meme is when like they say when your like card declines or when you have no insurance at the hospital and no one Stone Cold was hitting his uh hitting his leg with the cast is <laughs> like you're, you're, you think he'll fix your leg try to re-break the leg. That's funny. Um, I'm putting I'll put him above yeah, Hulk Hogan. I think he above Hulk Hogan. I think he I think he might be above many people. I, I might. I don't know. I think yeah, he might I think be above edge. A lot of, I, he, he helped a lot of these people. Yeah. He, I think he, I think he above edge. I think he above edge. Okay, that's fine. <sighs> okay, that's. Oh no! Now we got people. Let's say we got the Uso. Uso now, John, we we'll put you put you to the side again. <laughs> put you to the side again. Even me, uh, I'll, I'll put my average. Uh, average. Actually, no, I'm gonna put you to the side no too. Idea. They definitely, I'm gonna put you. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna look. I have For no you idea. WWE fans, I'm not gonna let that happen. They just <laughs> pinned Roman Reigns and beat that whole streak. They bloodline streak. So that, bloodline that, and before that, they was average. No, they had the most tag team titles I think of all time too. I'm not yeah, gonna do it. I'm I'm, I'm here for you. I'm here for you WWE fans. I I, I people a little bit. So I'm gonna put you at good career. I'm gonna be safe though. I'm not gonna put you ahead of um. I put you at leader. I'm put you right there. That's safe. I put you at safe spot. I have I'm, no I'm, idea. I'm good for y'all. Um, Cody Rhodes. Now, John, yo, Cody Rhodes is our right, Cody Rhodes. It's yeah. <laughs> <It's> completely different. <laughs> yeah, because you know what I'm saying. <laughs> that's, that's that forgettable, but hey, I, I do. I seen some of his work recently, so you know, he, Cody he made a push. Yeah, Cody. Yeah. Cody um reinvented himself when he left WWE, and. His gimmick and character is a lot better. His toughness is amazing. He's obviously the like main character, good guy in the company right now. And the number one, I'm putting my good career, but the number one thing that gives me like, hey, Cody, you did great. He faced Seth Rollins, right, in a Hell in a Cell match with a torn pectoral muscle. And it's one thing if you can't tell if it's torn. Oh, yeah, it's nasty. actually torn. Like you actually see the red bruise on his pec That's and nasty. it's visible. And he wrestled a long match. That is crazy. That the fact is, he, yeah. I don't know what that's that toughness is all time great. It is. I'm, I'm put you up there, Cody. I'm put you. I'm put you just from that tough. I'm, I'm be safe. I'm be safe. But I, no, he gotta be ahead. Booker T. I'm sorry. At this point, especially with the torn pack, I'm gonna put you right here. Um, I'm put you right there. The legacy days. Obviously, you know, John. I think maybe you remember him from maybe from like team with with uh, Randy Orton. Maybe I don't know, or maybe team with Ted DiBiase. That type of time, but. You know, we 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 are in a new age now. Yeah. We got black hair, right? 
Yeah, yeah, black hair. Now you got white hair. The, and, uh, and, and, the blue shorts, I believe. And blue pants and, or something like that. Yeah, and he married. He married to a sister too. He married to a black woman. You know what I'm saying? He oh, I thought. Okay, hair. never mind. Okay. So that's why he put him above. I thought she was like saying. <laughs> I'm hilarious. Um, Bret Hart is oh, obviously like, he, so he really is like he like dirt. Okay, he, he like dirt. That's yeah, he, crazy. No, for the culture, bro. for the culture. Um, Bret Hart obviously all time great. It depends where you put Bret Hart. Um, I don't want just, Bret just Hart to like be that. funny. Let's put him behind Shawn Michaels. <laughs> Trolls. <laughs> <laughs> the Montreal. I don't, I, I don't like know where we would put him at. I'm gonna put him in. Like I know he's all time great, but I feel like he's one of this those wrestlers that didn't have that much impact on me. So. Oh, like, this, this is Stone, just like we look at Stone Cold, The Rock, Undertaker, Ric Flair. I feel like those guys, you know, still had some type of impact on me. I, I can't really recall him. I don't remember. No, because oh, because 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 this is why Shawn Michaels obviously screwed him. So he left WWF ninety seven, and then Goldberg kicked him in the head when he was in the WCW and gave him a ridiculous concussion. Because Goldberg was a very unsafe worker back then, and now he then he retired because Goldberg he like. Oh, right in his head. Where like, Goldberg at? He not me on this shit. Oh yeah, he not. But Goldberg would be um, Goldberg be a good career. It wouldn't be nothing crazy. Man. Like th- that man was a very unsafe worker back in the day too. And his matches, though. he had a good move, but he unsafe. He his, his matches are quick because he not good at wrestling for long periods of time. Um, so yeah, I put him. He be a good career. It's nothing crazy. Um, Brett, I'm gonna put you, Brett. I'm gonna put you. Where well, I'm gonna put you at? Because um, I put you actually. Well, now Brett, Brett had a five star match with Stone Cold. If you maybe you would know this match, um, it was an I quit match and Stone Cold wouldn't give up. So you know Stone Cold was bleeding and he just passed out rather than give up in the match. That was a five star. So you know that was a, and that's what kind of started the like Stone Cold being a baby face. It was like it was the only one of the only times where both like you know two characters switched. Like Brett turned to a heel and Stone Cold turned to a face and they were the opposite before mm-hmm. the match. So that's the only time that like double switch usually happens. So that's a great thing. Look at the great Carl Lee. He's not forgettable, but he at the bottom. I'm not putting forgettable, but no, he low-key ter- no, he low-key terrible. He but terrible, I'm, no, yeah. I'm putting I'm putting my terrible. Actually, I'm putting my terrible. I ain't gonna lie to you. The good Kali. <laughs> he's not forgettable. He's like average. He's not Ooh. forgettable. But the only reason he's not forgettable is because like his height. I feel like that's like I his gimmick. Like I, I won't forget him because like his height. I don't know about that one. <laughs> you think he got like, good career? I gotta put him at least average. Like, I don't. Oh, Jesse, we can't hear you again. But just to... <laughs> you mean, and then you just muted yourself as well. All right, you hear me. I mean, he came in and, like, at least when I was watching, he came in, had, a, like, a lot of impact. Like, he was scared. He was stepping over the, the right. rings, the top of the rope. He had, like, a chop, bro. They're like, come on, that's crazy. He, he I... killed <laughs> Rey Mysterio on live TV. Like, he... he his, even I don't know how long he did wrestle, but that little period that I saw of him, it was pretty. Like he was on track to have a good career, but like I said, I, I, I don't know about good career. Stay, stay that long, so I'll leave average. I don't well, know. Actually, I don't think he was ever supposed to have like, John Cena. I think John Cena beat him up. I think John Cena won. They wasn't. I, uh, were they but really like, pushing him that much? I don't think. They no, I could have sworn they, they were. Like they. No, they, they pushed were, him. They yeah. did, John. You're right. They did push him. But the reason they pushed him is because everyone and their mom was injured in the summer of 07. Like everybody in their mama was injured. Like Edge was injured, Ray Mysterio was injured, uh Shawn Michaels was injured, everybody in the mama was injured. So they pushed Great Khali and I was like, okay, you're gonna you're gonna win a championship in a battle royal. And he won, but his matches so terrible that it's just like because he obviously it makes sense they're terribly big and slow. He didn't really but he can't, he can't talk. Now, like the now look, I'll tell you, John, the summer of 07 was he crushed Ray Mysterio and they they pushed it and Batista faced him in the Punjabi match and all that. See, that was that was cool. But and after the summer of 07, it just like and then when you left, when you left, he became a jobber, meaning someone who just loses like big four foot, no, four foot, seven foot man losing to like anybody and everybody. And he was dancing and stuff. It was, it was uh, yeah, he, his career just got it derailed very fast. Um, Marisa, obviously up to you. Obviously, John put him at average. I put him at terrible. Where do you believe? Forgettable. He should be forgettable, we, I, 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 but I can't forget him. Based though. off his height, you can't forget him. <laughs> I'm not gonna forget him. Maybe we should be. switch terrible and forgettable. Maybe terrible should be under right. average, and forgettable should be at the very bottom. Oh, I messed up. Wrong thing. Wrong thing again. Go up. Go up. And go up. There you go. Uh, okay, no, that's that's fine. But that's I mean, hilarious. Come on, bro. That's a, no, a chop, bro. That the chop. Right, I, I guess. Rikishi. Rikishi, man. That big butt. 
That's crazy. As shit. Bro, the fact that he had like grown men putting a face in his ass, <laughs> which is crazy. Like you gotta have a good career. Bro. <laughs> I, I I don't know. That's I I got put. You, I can't. He, I, don't he, know. I think he, if he's a good think player, Well, he likes the top average. He likes the. Top. I, I think I, I put. I might put you. I might put you because bro, no, you know the weirdest thing ever. Peak. Off of his gimmick alone, bro. You you got come on. Like what's his special? Was called a stink face. Like bro, that's one of those gimmicks. Too. That's like, one of them gimmicks. That's like, like if your parents Ill, walk bro. in, bro. Like that's like if, you, if your parents walk in and they see that, it's just like. But no, I like can't I used to watch this shit with my with my my whole family. Grandma grandma used to watch this shit. Like, I know. Drake I mean, Ramo used to watch this. We all were watching this. There, there was a time when some guy was like on the turnbuckle and he was like, come, like he wanted it to happen. Oh, he was I like, remember come. that. Yeah. And, and he was like, come on, give it, it to me. Like, and I was like, okay. Yeah, yeah right. Wrestling. That's, that's interesting. And then that's interesting. He, uh, he did it to Vince McMahon, right? The uh, the stink face. I could have sworn. Like, he did. I, I, I think The Rock put uh, The Rock put Vince McMahon's <laughs> face before. Him. So, yeah, Vince McMahon, we, yeah, he, he got he, he took some. Wait, wait, who, he, he really took some L's. Oh, the he Uso, took some bumps. The Uso sure. brothers, that's is that no? Who is their father? They're related. Yeah, that's that's They're their father. Yeah. Oh, that is their father. I think I think Rikishi. And you, I think oh, the, the twins. Usos, uh, these boys. Okay, okay. The, like look, so like Rikishi's related to obviously these boys Roman Reigns. I think it's supposed to be their cousin, but really Roman Reigns is Loki. They, I think actually their uncle. Um, the Rock has some relation somewhere there. Um, Yokozuna. There's a lot of the, this Samoan family runs deep. There's a lot of um, I, wrestling ties. So I, I want the reason I was saying I want to see who had a better career. If that was like the twins actually had a better career than their father. I mean, the, the father ain't win nothing besides just putting butts and faces. They ain't win nothing. <laughs> <W>. What butts <laughs> and faces? He didn't. That he wasn't taking it serious. That was very um. I would put him average high, but uh, what do y'all like feel? Like? To me personally, I don't think he above Miz. <laughs> he's not above Miz. I think I can't give him above, especially like later Miz. He he's he's the best average. I don't know. He's like the best average to me. Fine, <laughs> fine. He like must average. You think he was good career? I don't just know how long the, he wrestled. Just off the gimmick alone, like honestly, like he didn't. I don't recall him having that good of a career, but as, I just think it's funny. Yes, like it his character to me propels him to good career. Like <laughs> that's like a super ill. Like that's I don't know, bro. Like if you like, get the script all the, that week. It's you like you did all script. that shit just to be average. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> you get the script that week, and then you get the script that week, and then like, okay, you're going against Rakishi, and he's gonna, and then he he don't just put in your like he rub it and like <laughs> shake it, bro. Like, <laughs> I don't know. so yeah, average is fine. Average is fine. I'm surprised. Man, that he, he, he got pink eye doing that, boy. Yeah, yeah. Bro. That's funny as shit. And he's sweating. Oh, come on, bro. That's, I'll get off that. <laughs> that's so funny if, though. If I look at um our list, all time great list, obviously that's basically shows these is what we leave are the top. I mean, we're one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, plus nine, twenty. So actually twenty people even. Um they hold they got the whole thing. Yeah, they have the whole thing for wrestling. Of course, yeah. So Ric Flair number one, greatest wrestler of all time, Stone Cold number two, Rock number three, Undertaker, John Cena, Sean, Triple, Randy. Are we are we moving anyone up or down on this all time great list? Uh, I know John, you like Vince McMahon. You wanted to see, you know, he took a lot of bumps, so you think he had a um Foley? <laughs> I no, I don't know. I, I just think he it's weird to judge him because like, you know, you can't help but think of what he did outside of like being in the ring and outside of what people saw. So that's why I feel like that. But honestly, those guys are actually in the ring and getting thrown off cages and thump, landing on thumbtacks and being put through tables. So it's kind of hard to put them above it. But so this is what. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. So this is what I was going to ask all y'all. Like in this list, what what's bothering you? What person do you feel like? Dang, I need to move them up and move them down. What's bothering you in this list? I, I already know my guy, but you should probably already know. But what, is there anything on this list that's bothering you? Mm. Not really. I guess Hulk Hogan, but no, nah, he's he's all time great though. No, nah, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not trolling. I'm trolling. Don't troll him. He's all time great. <laughs> that man started hating Hulk Hogan. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, uh, I don't. Not really. I mean, everything everything else looks good to me. Maybe like maybe we can drop maybe. Brock Lesnar now. I, I don't know. I feel like when all time when I look at all time great, you gotta be like, yeah, I, it should, it's, I think it's too many people in all time great, honestly. I think I well, the how, well never mind, never nah, mind. Because that, that, those are those are all time great though. I can't like right. I don't think. I mean, the only person who's questionable is Brock Lesnar. Honestly, yeah. I could definitely think of Brock. 
Yeah, I think it's just the fact that Brock ahead of Chris and Chris Chris should be to me is like at the end of all time great. And then Brock is like up there sitting with no head. It's in there. <laughs> it's, 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 so it's a sign. <laughs> that, that's the only thing that's like, oh, what the heck? But that's the only yeah, thing that's. I mean, me. if you if you want to put him all time great, that's fine. Let me do. I won't debate it. Now that we like see the list and every. Oh yeah, Kane is bothering me. Oh, I feel, there you go. That, that's your guy. Yeah, there found we go. Him. <laughs> you found this guy. <laughs> I, I love Kane, bro. I want to do it for too, but I just can't. I Not think doing he nobody definitely else. Is Brock Lesnar, like. Oh, you said what you saying? Brock Lesnar yeah. would be too high. <laughs> no, 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 if, if really Kane high. is, yeah, Kane. I don't know. Kane definitely above Brock Lesnar. Like, make this, Kane, make this a short clip, and we got to see what the community thinks. Yeah, make yeah, sure we'll, that's a good. Yeah. I, I, I'll keep, I'll keep all of this, so I, I can like do many clips and see what like the wrestling fans think. See if we're fools or not. I think um, the biggest <laughs> shit is probably it's, it's it has to be Brock either Brock between Brock and Kane or Brock and Jericho. Like who's should be up there, but see when we when we did Jericho, it was like at the beginning, and I was just thinking about like we need to add Stone Cold, we need to add uh, the Rock, we need to add John Cena, Triple H. So we had a lot of people to add. So I was just trying to like keep the all time great to minimum. But now that like we we put so many people on there, yeah. (laughs) But I mean, but yeah, I mean, there were a lot of wrestlers, so like. Yeah, if I did the whole list, sense. like if we did that, but if I did that, like 100, 200 people list, like John, it'd be blank, blank. You blank out for 15, 20 of them, but like, yeah, you wouldn't know most. So I, I oh, make like sure mo- you, majority of them, like newer people. Like yeah. the there's, there's, there's a mix of newer and older people, but like, if I go through, if we go like 15 new people, he's gonna be like, oh, that wasn't, and he wasn't here in 08. Oh. He wasn't here in 07. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I still, you know, a guy who was here in 07, and John, I'm asking you, what do you think about Bobby Lashley? Where would you put him? If oh, it was that's a good one. I mean, he he remind me of Batista, so I wouldn't put him all time great. I'll put him good career. He, I mean, he, yeah, I enjoy him when he wrestled. Oh, he averaged. But that's the. Uh, but I know all saying. I'm, I'm not gonna. gonna I'm not no, gonna I'll debate that. that. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm like not that gonna one. debate it. <laughs> he not somebody. I'll be like, no, nah, no, nah, he should be good career. He's not like a Kane or something. I I wouldn't debate that. But he had good like. He didn't even his, have my favorite wrestler of all time on him. The gimmick when he like holding people up like in, on his shoulder, like uh, he's like walking around. He has like his arms out. That's pretty dope. So Jesse, I got a question for you then. If you think Carlito is forgettable, what about Chris Masters? Now he also well he they ain't the same thing. They literally was tag teams too. But Chris Masters had the master lock. No, the thing is they, they, they have. I, I don't even know who that is. But I know what the master have, lock is. They have those moments. Like they have like the thing about them gimmicks do they have those like one shot things that are really good and you watch and if you watch if you like smack love versus raw and you be able to put them on the master lock or the master lock challenge like they had entertainment yeah. stuff like that but then you know it didn't last like it just it just vanished <laughs> what, about, what, about, what about cogsworth <laughs> who is that his name cogsworth Hogsworth. oh you said, wait, wait the, guy, the, midget, the midget right yeah no, wait, who oh Cogs, you mean horns one yeah, oh i thought his name was cogsworth yeah. what's cogsworth from is that from like you t- Harry Potter? Talking about the midget. <laughs> that from like Harry Potter or some shit? I mean, like yeah, Lord of the, the Rings. He used to wear that green. He used to hop yeah, well, out of the ring. Yeah. <laughs> Not Mr. Kennedy. That was with um Finley. Oh, Fr- Finley, yeah. My fault. Finley. Oh, no. Yeah. Hey, I tell you. Oh, hey, wrestling boy. He said, oh, you remember all that? <laughs> That's Finley, but with the shillelagh. Is that what the name of that stick was called? Yeah, the shillelagh, yeah. That's crazy that you remember what the name of that shit is. Oh, no. I got I, I got great memory. And wrestling is hilarious back yeah, in the day. Yeah, what would he be at? Where uh Finley? Yeah, no, the short dude. The Hornswoggle? One. Average? Um, yeah, he be at, well, I yeah, he average. average. Well, I don't know. I, don't know. Well, I, was... I think, I think, I think it's terrible. actually. I don't know. I don't want to like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's like, hey, it's... that's not something I'll argue. <laughs> he, he, yeah. I'm he like, think what impact did he really have besides he, when they said yeah, that was his son? <laughs> I forgot that was about that too. That's hilarious. Um, skits. He had he had like shorts and skits with like DX, and I'm just like, this this old nine dog. No, John, you weren't you weren't watching that one. Who was supposed to be on in this and list? out a little bit, you know. None. Oh. I wasn't heavily into it like I was, you know, in the peak times. Who else is missing from this uh, list? Rob Van definitely... Down. Oh yeah, he put him at good that, career. That was my favorite wrestler. He put him at so, good career. Probably Macho Man. Randy so you Savage. know where he got to go. No, nah, we we don't talk. We, no, that's not. He not. Great. enough. No, nah, that's he crazy. But Macho Man. The five star frog splash. There you now go. he 
he he'd be he'd be good career. I can't for a long time. Yeah, I'm yeah. great. Well, if he no, EC, if you talking about ECW, you talking about ECW Rob Van Dam, like strictly ECW, then you but WWE he it's you know he he won the title. Mentality. He won the title, but then he he um I think he was smoking weed, so they they um they, they let Edge really him. but That's it's this crazy. OC this oh six though, so we in different time. Yeah, we <laughs> no, what about MVP? WC. He average. MVP yeah, average. he average. He was funny, I, I like though. I liked him though. Mike but Skills was decent, you know. Montel Vontanius Porter, that's his name. Montel. And I thought that was a real name too. I was like, that's such a stupid name thinking back. But like, that's his name? Th- no, of course not. That's his yeah. gimmick. What do you think? Do you think that's his name? Yeah. <laughs> or Mr. Kennedy when he had the um, the mic drop and then that 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 was they had some good characters, man. I'll tell you. They had like he used to scream. Mr. Kennedy. Yeah, he, Kennedy. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I liked him actually. Surprisingly. We've I That's feel like the, we missing some other people though. The, the other people you missing list. is not gonna be I don't think they're gonna be like the people though. I don't know. They're not they're gonna be like mid card people that you remember off one. There's nobody that we missing that should be on an all time great list, is what you're saying. Nah, man. You know what I'm saying? This is a bunch of mid card people you're gonna be thinking. Oh, I remember him. He had it like with the boogeyman, like you know, the boogeyman be a the, the, boogeyman in terms of like he not forgettable. He tell, he. I'll put him at terrible, but he's not terrible at the same time. Like he didn't do nothing, but he's like funny. It's just to be like. <laughs> oh, hey, worms, bro. He, yeah, but we, we who's so for, we don't got no forgettable people. Who, like, we gotta, I don't know, maybe like well, what y'all thought about oh, Paul London? I think he was kind of on the tail end as well. Oh, 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 he, oh, he definitely forgettable too. I, don't know, I, don't <laughs> I know heard that, that man is. name. <laughs> I, I heard that man name in thirty years. He said Paul London. I don't know um, who that is. Or Brian Kendrick. Right now. Brian Kendrick. Brian or, Kendrick um, just sounds familiar. His name sounds familiar. John Morrison, maybe that's a mid carter you can remember. John Morrison put him in the or Johnny Nitro, whichever one you want to put him at. Oh, um, um, you can. Oh, what about um? Rest in peace, my man Shad, Shad and JTG. Oh, it's crime time. The guy who, it's, yeah. it's crime time. Brooklyn, Brooklyn. We gotta do a WWE. Um, we gotta do a theme what song. What about Jerry Lawler? Right? I mean, he's talking about. It depends what he's doing. Like, if he like, commentator, he yeah, definitely com- goat. Commentator. Him and uh, what's my man? Jr. Good old Jr. Jr. got on there and ran the mic for a little bit too. He was doing the thing. With Michael Cole. Oh, yeah, he was the Ultimate dude. Warrior. He not on there. He not all time great. No, I mean he is, but like we don't know him, and it's like we don't. We I can't. Oh, you can't. That wrestling is such like it's what not about, as entertaining. Can we, like, can we not talk about one person? You can't. Talk, are you serious? I can't talk about him. Why? It's not going to get demonetized. That man, John, like, no, but no, John, you're no, this is your time, though. We you're in this time. <laughs> John is in this time. Him. John is in this time. What he do? Sure. We call him, I call him, I call him insert player, too. I like how he said, I like how he asked where he did. Like, <laughs> well, I mean, you can't talk about him. You can't talk about him. So he did something, something awful. No, look, look, look. God, awful. Football he, players get this a lot. He's not, mm. he not, he not gonna get it. You know, we talking about. Insert you know, player like, two. That, that that was a big that was huge back in 07. I, I feel like if you say his and name, you'll you'll get it. Yeah. It's it's a dark they make nah, I'm not gonna they, they make his a lot name, of dark jokes about him. They do. His name is Christopher. Oh okay, yeah, I got Chris Benoit. Yeah, yeah. He's a he's a really good wrestler. Yes. He, I mean he could all time great. I mean, in terms of being a wrestler, but he never gonna make the Hall of Fame because obviously he had a bad ending. So yeah, I call him insert player too because he'll never be in WWE like history. Like they erased them from all time. Like I think if you go to a website and it shows the Royal Rumble winners, I think he won 04. Like 03 and they skipped 05. It's like we, we don't even have the 04. Really? That, that 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 Royal Rumble didn't exist. His special was kind of cool too. The Crippler Crossface, yeah? No, the, well, well, or, well, he used to suplex you like three times in a row. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I forgot he had a submission. You're right. Yeah, well, oh, the Big Show, no, he's not all time great. I'm trying. To, oh, I'm really trying to show. find some people. There we go. I mean, Big Show. Yeah, I'm trying to find people that, who that, actually good career. That's good career. He's good career. Good career. Good career. Yeah. To... All right. And, and Marie, watch Seamus. Shame for <laughs> Seamus. Now he good career. Yeah, good or career. average. He like right, right there. Good career. To average. I, I think he low good career. He had low good career. Um, there gotta be other people, dog. John, so wait, John, your favorite wrestler was RVD, right? Yeah. Okay, well there you go. So that's somebody else. Gold dust, no. Nah, we yeah, yeah. yeah, gold right. dust is funny. <laughs> gold dust, he he said, he, but he used to creep me out though. Same. He also used to creep me out a little oh, bit. Yeah, I really don't remember him that much, but like, I don't remember him wrestling, but I do remember him like 
seeing them on the screen and stuff. I probably used to turn it off when he used to wrestle. Tough. Yeah, he used to kind of creep me out. Kurt Angle, no, I don't know who that is. Harley yeah. Race. No, nah, like you like say you you getting them old boys. You getting no. you getting them old boys. Them boys when nobody remember. Sting. I think, nah. I think everyone that you we got up here besides the big show, that was a good one to also talk about. What about Dusty think, Rhodes? Rest in peace. Um They have him top six on this list. I know, but like look, I just for the old all time wrestlers, then you can but for us, Dusty Rhodes was not gonna entertain you as much as for us. Dusty Rhodes is not going to entertain you as much as The Rock. Well, we did say WWE, and I don't know if Dusty Rhodes was actually in the WWE. Yeah, he just helped Cody get into the WWE. Good job, though, because Cody, hey, Cody, shout out to you, boy. Cody, you can get up there, keep winning, and if you keep wrestling with freaking broken well, There's one person we could say, though. Pecs, what? There's one person we could say that, I mean, we didn't watch him wrestling. No, he would be, he'd probably be a good girl. Well, Andre the Giant. Mm. I mean, he he would be an all-time great, actually. He would be an all-time great. Well, that's one he's very... Yeah, yeah, he remember the Miss? The miss? Are you yeah. talking about um the um Asian man? The um yeah, he's just miss. Spit that it was green fu- stuff in your like face. Fujiri or something like Fujiri or something I like know that. The girl who did, who did some, oh, right. yeah, he had that no, green stuff, not. right? Yeah, the green miss. Yeah, that was. All right, what about Gregory Helms? Yeah. What was the the hurricane? Oh, uh, yeah, he. Remember that? He had that one gimmick where he used to just pause and put his arm up like that. And the rock, he was toying toy- with the rock back and forth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah I call him the hamburger. The hamburger. Yeah, I think that's it. That's probably all. That, yeah, that's I don't see anybody else. When did uh, the rock retire? Uh, he retired permanent, like for like permanent, it was 03, then came back one match in 04, and then came back 2011 to face John Cena in uh, WrestleMania the next year. He he's he's retired. He's retired. He uh, running with uh, Hurricane. That was 03. Dang, he was there early? He, he started like ninety seven. He yeah, started ninety seven. The hurricane? No, the, the rock, rock ninety seven. No, no, when did the hurricane start? Like oh one ish, two thousand. Really? I could have sworn he was on like more on the tail end, like the oh six, oh seven ish. No, he probably jumped in and out. He's like he probably jumped in the segment and jumped out. But him and the rocks like banter was definitely like he was getting screen time. That was that was oh three. Oh, damn. I didn't know he was that early. I thought he was a little later. The Rock's heel work is the best heel work of all time. That's the one that you get to get a good laugh. Usually you get pissed at heels, but that's some no. He call him the Hamburglar and stuff. Go go make the Rock a McCheese. I don't know. I, <laughs> that's fucked up. I need that. Yeah, oh, that's the Rock was on everybody. That's that's great. He he has movie star for a reason. Good good charisma there. But that was our list, guys. Um, tier list of all the WWE superstars. Now, I know you may disagree with some, maybe you agree with all of us. You know, comment down below. Do you agree with us? Do you think we're noobs? You know, remember, John's memory ends at 08. Like, that's where it so if, you, if you're watching, just remember 08. <laughs> so that's it. And then Maurice, obviously, he's in and out with it. And me, I come and jump in, jump out. But yeah, we'll do more tier lists, wrestling tier lists, especially if you like this one. We could do one for best matches we saw, we could do one for the best, um, What's called theme songs. So that's about that's about best theme songs, definitely things of that nature. So we'll do more um, tier list for you. It's the summer. You got nothing else to do. Watch me and us. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. It's the road to five hundred. Thank you guys for watching, and we will catch you in the next video. We're out of here. Peace. <laughs>